One, two, three, one, two, three, oh, four, yeah. one, two, three, one, two. That's gonna be a mess in post. Yeah, one, two. Mm -hmm. Indie twat. Okay. But you know how French. One, two, I used three. to think. You did French? No, I used to think Polly had a French class. But nah, bro, Polly. Polly had a, they lost all their classes. They used to have the, yeah, the so. car class. Car? Yeah, like mechanics, oh. bro. You know that one room? Um, No, it's literally the SOC Center. That's oh, why it's so it. big. There's oh. a second floor, bro. That's a, that was that a mechanic was a room. Oh, Camera shoot. Rolling. And we lost that. Camera rolling? Camera rolling? All right, is audio rolling? Oh, it's been rolling. Well, uh, wait, what do we have to do at the beginning? Three, two, one. Oh, yeah, do the clap thing first. And also do yeah. the, um, do you want to count down? You count down. All right, from three? three? Yeah, if you want 20 or something. 20? Yeah, I don't know, whatever you want. Okay, okay. Which is your number? 10? Yeah. 9? 8? Five. 7? 6? 11? Bits. 5? Maybe, maybe five. 5, 4? 3? Door. 2? 3? And 1? <laughs> Right, welcome go. to the Chompy Show. Oh, welcome, bro. Episode welcome. six. Episode right? six. six. Yeah, I, I think six. I, yeah, yeah, I yeah, said yeah, that six, number six, right. Six, yeah, 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 yeah. For sure, six. Yeah. Imagine it isn't. Mm -hmm. It's like number eight. Hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's up? How are you, bro? Yeah, I'm I mean, good. we were kind of already talking. A yeah, lot. a little bit. We, we, had, a, we had a little yipping, yapping yeah, session. Yeah, yeah. Uh, with McDonald's. Mm -hmm. What's it called? Um, and my coffee right here. Thank yeah. you, by the way. Be fierce. Yeah. Be fierce. That's a sponsorship. That's ad money that funded that. So. Please Thank send me money so I could give my guests more gifts. Thanks, yeah. man. I appreciate it. So um, we were talking about Polly. We were talking and, about Polly. Um, what were we talking about? How people are Oh, I was saying, like, bro, yeah, when I went, like, a lot of the kids these days, they're more to themselves. And yeah. I'm like, you know, like, not as last year. Like, we used to be active. Mm -hmm. That's like, you know, you're missing the school spirit. You should come back. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. I did, I did actually. Yeah, uh, yeah you did, and you uh, promoted Jerry Klein scholarship. Mm -hmm. Check that out. Uh, when is this? <laughs> please check it out. You guys need it. It's free money. I I want to know that statistic. He told me that um, this class of twenty twenty four had way less applicants for like college yeah, than last year. That's true. Yeah, it's because of TikTok and all that. TikTok, all that. Like, I feel like more kids are like to themselves now. Yeah, they don't want to like express themselves. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say this too. I think that also kind of got rid of a like. Like bullying, you know, bullying. Maybe I'm just not seeing it. They got rid of bullying, like no, you know, like they they petitioned it off and then like they got rid of it. Yeah, change.org. They oh, got like yeah? five. Like votes. stop bullying. Yeah, stop. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. No, but I feel like since everyone's so like to themselves, it's mm -hmm. um, people don't really just go out of their way to to aggro other people. I feel that. Yeah, I yeah. feel that too. Yeah, they're more just like. That's what I th I think why that's not they're not going to college. They feel like everything's just gonna come to them. You know? Oh yeah, that's true. Like you know they're by themselves, like doing all that. They're like, oh yeah, like the government's just gonna give me money, you know, mm. or like my mom's gonna pay for it. Like I'm good. Like I'm just gonna take a break here. Yeah. But like once they take the break here, you know the break here becomes like break Decade? twenty years. <laughs> the so, break life, bro. Break life, exactly. <laughs> and they're just stuck in that nine to five after that. Yeah. That's... You know I feel like they don't understand like how much like. Like that one guy in the library, like the garage, you know, with the Lambo. Like, <laughs> like knowledge is power for real, bro. That's so true, bro. Yeah, I think, do you think Polly has had a homeless dude yet? Like, they a graduated, they became homeless? <laughs> well, I mean, probably, yeah. We what had think, oh, yeah. like 100,000 students. In At least one of them, ho like homeless. Yeah, from all the years. Really? Yeah, yeah, but I think that'd only be like a recent thing. I mean, have you seen, I mean, I know one of them's a freaking mass murderer. Yeah. Oh, the, yeah, the, the Las the Vegas, Vegas dude. Yeah, yeah. Nah. Yeah, that we for sure. Have he would live like right here in the valley, bro. We yeah. Polly, yeah. Bird, and Fernandez. Really? Oh, yeah. Yeah, bro. Fernandez. Where's that at? That's like, like down the street, the elementary what? school. Oh, that's not elementary. Yeah, that's where I went. Do you? Oh, at Fernandez. All I know is Strathern. You went to? What, I didn't go to Strathern. I went to. Have you heard of Vina? Vina? Yeah. Vina. I think one of my homies went there. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I went. It's not that far, but I had to put my address as my cousin's house because he lived really close. Yeah. For the, yeah. I guess yeah, just to be thing, accepted. Yeah. I don't get that. Yeah. Like, if I want to go to school in... It's Illinois, just your homeschool, like, you know, your, where you, like, you could just walk to school and stuff. Yeah. Because, you, know? you know, high school, they middle school, they don't have, like, the cars or nothing. Yeah. How far is for now? <clears throat> oh, you said it's down the street? Yeah. I, like, live in the middle, but I can walk yeah. there. Uh, yeah, but I went to, in middle school, I went to Madison. Madison? Madison, James Madison Middle Wait, School. Wait, middle school? You didn't go to Bird? I did, in seventh oh. grade. Oh. I moved, yeah, bro. Why did you move? Uh... It was not just not, not my people, you know. The uh, teachers are good. Uh -huh. They're just, uh, you know, uh, yeah, bro. There's not my people. Like, they, <laughs> I had all my homies back in Bird, oh, like okay. from Fern and mm. all that stuff. So I just moved. Mm. You know, I was like, hey, like I, we used to game all the time. And I was like, bro, like I'm coming, bro. Like I hate it. I hate it. We got to like I hate all these people. And then yeah, I went. 
Where were you when Fortnite popped off? <laughs> where was I when Fortnite popped off? Yeah. I was uh, I was in Bird. Mm. Seventh grade, yeah. That's mm. when I started playing Fortnite. We were playing 2K17. Yeah, bro. I was pretty good at Fortnite. You think so? Yeah. Then did you make any money earnings? Um I made like twenty twenty five dollars off wages. Uh, <laughs> nah, bro. Honestly, like me and my duo back in the World Cup days, like start, shout out hyper by the way. Like we 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 were out there, bro. We almost got like top five hundred, but yeah. his dad, bro, his dad sold. <laughs> like he had to go clean like his the garage and stuff, bro. Like during a mid tournament when he had like Cause it used to be like out of ten games, right? Like uh-huh, the most yeah. points, mm-hmm. and like mid like five games, like we had like a, a win and like a bunch of points, and then we can we couldn't finish oh, our games, bro. So people just passed us. He he couldn't get his dad to like. Nah, bro. Nah. His dad was like, bro, like what the fuck? <laughs> Playing video games, you're not gonna earn money. <laughs> yeah, that's bro. Crazy, we sold, bro. but yeah, I, bro. I think that's why we have homeless people. Mm-hmm. Having parents shoot down your <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, probably. <laughs> have you heard of the Jerry Klein wager? The Jerry Klein wager? Yeah, I, I, was, I did that one. Oh, I actually won, won that you one. You won that one? I won that you Jerry Klein points? wager. Yeah, bro. Uh, Me and Jerry Klein. I won v one him <laughs> on box fights. And Gee. yeah, I, I kind of like edited, like mm-hmm. coned him, boxed him, and I won. Ah, that's crazy. And he just gave you it? He gave him some money, yeah. yeah. Do you know what that dude does? Oh, Mr. Vanessian told me he was... Um, He's comp side. Yeah. I talked about it in the class. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, a cheat code, yeah. oh, yeah, You were in there. Yeah, I was like, he's he's comp side, like, just talk about you coding and, you know, like, how you grew up with tech, and he'd be like, wow, this is beautiful. <laughs> Who was, yeah. Who's the dude to the right of you? To the dude to the right? That's yeah. Luis. Bro, that guy is smart. Shout yeah. out Luis, bro. He, yeah, he's, he's some crazy coder, bro. Mm. Like, you know, th- you know, like, I feel like, I won't say this, like, I feel like some people, like, they see me like <laughs> we're gonna I grab was it. Hold on, hold on. Hey, it's, it's <laughs> you know I dislocated my shoulder twice. What the doing what? Grabbing coffee? <laughs> Probably something yeah. similar to that, yeah. Alright, so yeah. what were you saying? Oh yeah, I was just saying, yeah, like you know, people look up to people like even like cause there's always gonna be someone above you. Yeah. You know, so you just gotta have that motivation, you know, like mm-hmm. I'm gonna be better than this guy. Or like, you know, dream big type mm-hmm. you know, dream big. Yeah. So, like, that guy, like, I motivate, he motivates me because he has, like, a whole, like, Amazon scholarship and all that stuff. He like, was 40,000. He was the one that won that? Mm-hmm. I think I remember seeing an Instagram post. Like, out of, like, the whole nation. Mm. And then he went to, like, some internship in New York. And I'm like, damn, bro. So, what? Yeah. what, you're going to do a uh, comp sci? Or For, you're just, like... I'll see. I'm exploring the waters. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, I'm going right. to be honest. I feel like I still don't know what to do. Hey, bro, but, like David said, bro, just learn Python. Uh, yeah? Yeah, yeah I will... I, that's like you're the second person to say that, so I think. I think so, yeah. I'll just wait for the tenth person to tell me. The tenth person? Then, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's I what mean, TikTok tells me to wait until things are given to you. Exactly, like yeah. the, like the cards, like the tarot cards. Yeah. Yeah. It said like. Like just wait until ten times. Yeah, ten I'll times to it. commit to something. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You know, yeah. you saying how like someone is always like mm-hmm. above you. Mm-hmm. I think like. The reason religion started is because some dude was just better than everyone, and he still needed a. <laughs> some dude was just better than everyone yeah like he was like on top of everyone but he still needed a role model so he well just yeah chose god i mean I, yeah, I guess i could see that mm-hmm. but i feel like it's just like what people yeah like look up to like whatever they follow and like yeah i guess just having someone better than you yeah i don't know to me like religion right now it's just like like a lot of people do that in the older times you know like to grow armies and all that stuff oh, yeah. taking over you know, like, like you know how the, like, the armies took over, like, India and all that stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I feel like it was just used to get power. And, really? like, you know, but it also unites people, so it's really mm-hmm. good. It's interesting, huh? <clears throat> like the... Sorry, sorry. The, were, were there Islamic crusades? I think so, yeah. yeah. I know they took over... It's been over, a while since history class. Yeah. I know they took over Spain. They did. Yeah. yeah the they, Moorish kingdom. Yeah, there's a lot of, there's a lot of Muslims everywhere because mm-hmm. of that, you know? So it was one of the top top religions right it's it's the fastest growing religion dude Firas tells me this that every he's a stat, second. he's that master yeah he told me that it's the fastest growing religion and it just reached like two billion people recently two billion yeah that's crazy that's kind of insane yeah a lot of people they have like you know some beliefs good mm-hmm. beliefs it's like quran's like literally like arabic bible pretty much yeah yeah it's interesting i think it's taken more seriously than the bible definitely yes because so. yeah i feel like a lot of people kind of focus on like only some parts of the Bible and then just ignore everything else. I feel you. Some like of it, some of the quotes, like Psalm sixteen nine and all that stuff. Yeah. 
But the, <laughs> but the Quran, they say like the whole, like, you know, yeah. the whole passage. They, they read the whole book. They're like, to boy, you. You actually, and then they say, say some crazy stuff. Yeah. Word on the block. Word? Is that um, you won something with your project, Emmer said. Mm. Damn, how did that reach the block? I just did, bro. <laughs> it's active. It's, it's active? Hot. Yeah. Yeah, the, yeah the I did. I won, like, uh, it's not, honestly, I did get carried. I'm getting carried a lot in high school by my homies. Like I meet some, I you meet some smart ass people in high school. Really, high school, college. My bad, my bad. Oh, you're talking college, about college? college? Oh, yeah, yeah. guys, sorry. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> my brain scrambled the coffees. There's something yeah, in there. <laughs> anyway, yeah, Shit, no. In college, you meet like some crazy smart people, and like, you know, that's like you know, you look up to that. Like you get motivated off them. Mm-hmm. Or at least me. Yeah. So like, yeah, I got put on. I got put onto a lot of projects, mm. and I met this guy named John. John. Yeah, some some white dude from Anaheim. Mm. And no, he's from Orange, Orange County. Mm, okay. Yeah, and uh, yeah, bro, we did some project like about AI, and like cleaning up the LA River, trying to find like you know you know using neural networks. Uh huh. You know what that means? And PyTorch. PyTorch. What is that? PyTorch. It's like a language in Python. Mm. Like it's like a you know how, like Open AI. You can add it to your. You could add it to. It's like an API, pretty much. Okay. Yeah. And <laughs> so, would would your thing work? Like, um, if we actually develop it, but we're gonna. The thing is, like, we use satellite images to find clusters in LA River using neural networks. Mm. Oh my bad. What are neural networks? That's not good. Neural, neural networks? networks. So it's like um, it's like machine learning where like it learns off of your like, off of your data pretty much. So okay. if we put in like try to, like find one cluster in the river, it's gonna find that cluster and it's gonna look for similar things, mm. like similar clusters, because obviously like clusters are not gonna be the same shape. Yeah. So it's gotta look for that. So it just gets better each and every time. It gets better and better. That's what like ChatGPT is pretty much. Yeah. So the LA River is just like in terms of its dirtiness, its clusters. I thought it was just like well, obviously not. Yeah, exactly. So like our thing, our project was more like um, like finding those clusters and having like people on foot like look for trash. Also like volunteering. It's kind of okay. The thing is, honestly, it's not gonna work. Like we just got the best in class because everyone else in our in our class, like it was cut low key mid. Okay. It, it was an engineering like research class. So, okay. Yeah, but we did win, and I was so surprised. Like I was, I went there with a hoodie on, I see. and like all my all my teammates, we had they had like button up shirts, and I was like, yo, what? Like we won? Like because I was choking up around the presentation. I was like, uh, yeah, the, the the LA River. I was like, bro, couldn't believe it. So, yeah, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I guess they liked the idea though. That was good. Mm-hmm. Oh, Vanessa was talking about that. He did. So, he was gassing me up. Yeah, he was, bro. He was like, "These are." He was like, "I thought they would hate me, but they love me," or something like that. Because you had it for two years. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, he's a funny dude, bro. He's he his jokes look he hit. <laughs> I think <laughs> he's like a dad, bro. Yeah. Man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. And dude, he has a crazy backstory. Like, he, did he tell you that? I he doesn't tell us, bro, but, but he has a newspaper. Yeah, yeah he has the, the, the um, I guess like Polly had eleven. A, yeah, the Polly had a, um, um, magazine, I guess, and I was it's reading right down some as well. Yeah, I was reading it, and um, I was like, no way. And so he's from Iran. He's from Iran. He grew up there, like born, grew up. Yeah, he grew up there, and then he got a wife and like a kid, right? Uh-huh. I think so, if I'm yeah. saying the story right. And yeah. then he became like a refugee in, in the America. war. Yeah, because there was a war back there, and he mm-hmm. came a refugee, and he came back, came to America, like to pursue his like com- computer science and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. I, th- I think he did school in uh, Iran too, and uh-huh. then he came here. Yeah, he went to University of Tehran. Yeah, yeah. So he's he's like, he's smart, bro. Yeah, that's crazy. That's, that is crazy. Is he Armenian? It, like nah, he's Farsi. Genetically? He speaks Farsi. Oh, okay, I definitely because he he's like you know Arabic. Like he told me, that. I was like yeah, yeah, I know the alphabet. Like, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. how many languages does he know? Uh, I think he knows Farsi, English. Oh, I, should, bro, I don't know his whole life story. I don't know. <laughs> nah, but I remember every time like some Indian thing used to come up on the screen, he used to look at me, bro. He's like, he's like hey, I do. Hey. I'm like, bro, what is? <laughs> <laughs> and like me and like me and the homie Mauricio would be like, like bro, like we just laugh at each other. He's like, bro, why is he looking at you? But like it's funny, bro. Mauricio, I found his Instagram. Mm-hmm. What do you know? What he's up to? Like, do you guys still talk? Mm-hmm. I just saw him today. Oh, yeah. That's sick. Yeah, he's uh he's doing good. He's working at Costco. Oh, Costco. Yeah, he's getting his stuff done. You do know? you know which one? <laughs> Want me to leak it? Yeah. 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 
You know, I'm gonna leak it. Sorry, Marcy. He's working on the Sherman Way. Sherman Way. Sherman right, Way right, Costco. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. You know they have Costco in Australia. They do. Yeah. Some dude on TikTok told me. Yeah. He was like, "Why wouldn't we have it?" I was like, "I don't know." <laughs> That's like forty million years away. I don't. I think like upside down. Yeah. Is it upside know. down? I think like their stuff is on the ceiling. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, was, I was thinking that yeah. too. Like maybe like you go in the Costco, you like <laughs> like twirls around and stuff. What do they do in Australia? I don't know. I don't really. I don't get it. I don't. I have a friend. I wonder if he even knows about this podcast. We were supposed to meet up because you know how like L.A. A lot of people go like visit and stuff. Yeah. So we were supposed to like hike through the Hollywood um, sign together. But okay. then I was in Santa Clarita the whole day. Wow. So you so you, I was able on to, it. Yeah. Low key. I, I hey, felt bro. bad. I was like. I was telling my mom I was like yo And it was like We were too far Like an online homie or like, Yeah online homie bro Yeah bro that's yeah, We've been knowing for a while Bro you know this uh, An online homie we met In like When I was in 6th grade Like I was just I queued up randomly In Cod Zombies Origin And I met this guy Named OG Ghost mm. And we used to play Like all day And like he never used to talk And then he finally started talking Like after like Like 6 months mm-hmm. He started using his mic And he's like yo what's up And then like We don't Cause we needed to talk For the like, zombies Easter yeah. eggs And stuff and like after that, we found out like we he goes to we he goes to like our middle school and everything. Really? And we're like, you know, you're uh, George, right? And he's like, what the fuck? Like, cause we found his shit. Uh huh. And yeah, but he like skates around, and then we met up with him, and he was like a grade older than us. Mm. So like we met up with him, and we just started skating and everything, and uh, basically like a friendship formed, bro, off yeah. COD Zombies. That's so funny. He thought we were DDoSing him, bro. We're like, no Are way, you little bird. He's like, what the? F-? We're like, bro, you're in the valley. He's like, yeah, I'm like, bro, this feels crazy. You, you meet some like, crazy people on, yeah. online. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I kind of stopped meeting people online. I, I guess I stopped playing like games that have you. Yeah, well, you were saying how everyone's closed off. Yeah, bro, just, that's what I'm saying. Like everyone's just like playing solo, solo games yeah. and stuff. <laughs> You know, you got to play multiplayer. Yeah, it's you know? fun, bro. Sometimes. Talk shit with people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bro. Well, also. Like you said, people are sensitive, bro. Exactly. And you get banned. It's very easy to get banned on any game. I was looking exactly. at like older things, like um, like COD games from like the early 2010s, and I feel like it was just way more like active. Free. Yeah. Freedom of speech, you know. Mm, First yeah. Amendment. But now it's like the freedom yeah. of speech is gone. Like you can't even talk shit like on Rainbow or nothing. Yeah. That's and then great. like reported kid, like have a nice day, and uh-huh. then you're gone for seven days. <laughs> One time, uh, my my homie Hovik. Yeah, he, uh, I guess I trash talked him like in messages just for fun, and he was kind of salty, and he reported me, and I got banned for like a week. Bro. Exactly, bro. <laughs> That's what I mean. Like, and like the new the new softwares are out. Like, uh-huh. you could just easily like catch that. Yeah, and just ban you for that. Mm-hmm. You know, Rainbow removed the um kick a teammate feature. They did. I it was. It's that. already been a while. What was that? Oh. oh. I, that won't appear in the recording. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he's tripping, bro. He's hearing stuff. I don't you didn't know hear that? No. Yeah, I heard it. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> What's it called? Um, no, yeah. They. I remember I played for the first time again in like 2020. And I was trying to kick some dude out. And it just didn't work. I was like, oh. Damn, bro. Yeah. Because people would abuse that. I guess yeah. it kind of makes sense. It was a sense. toxic community. Yeah. It's a good time. fun. Yeah. And then um, it's don't... hard to team kill now. Mm-hmm. I feel like they're eventually just going to remove team killing. Probably, but honestly, like, I don't even play games that much anymore. Yeah. Oh, I stopped too. I the mean. games, games are getting boring. You know, it's not like the old days no more. You know what? I'm gonna be honest. I used to think the same thing mm-hmm. until I found a group of people to play with, and then games became fun again. I think games only become boring um, when you solo. Mm-hmm. So like, if you're just getting on by yourself, I think that's just yeah, exactly. Bo- yeah. So the homies always tell you hop yeah. on. Yeah, exactly. And you gotta join them mm-hmm. because that's that's when games are truly fun, bro. Damn, I, 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 my throat, I swear. What? <laughs> it's laced yeah. with the uh, the one the fan, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the pencil tip. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the pencil tip. Yeah, I, I play with. I, I'm I'm homies with a bunch of uh so juniors. Yeah, They're juniors now. Huh? Yeah, and so I play with them because. I don't know. I don't really rock with the seniors that much. Well, no, no, this, I do, like, but like, Polly? yeah, you don't I, rock with the seniors. No, I do, but it's not like the same as like. Yeah, have you juniors. heard that classmates? <laughs> like, you don't rock with you guys. <laughs> no, they're cool. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't really think anyone's like weird or anything, but I just think like the eleventh graders are more like out there. They're out there. They're they're less um, nonchalant. Or whatever. More like crazy. You gotta yeah. stay nonchalant, you know? Yeah. Nonchalant. You, you could dance a little, but you just gotta yeah, stay you nonchalant just, a little. Just gotta, like, 
you know let it let it go through you but that's it bro don't mm-hmm. don't don't go through it let it go through you don't forget that yeah. pause yeah <laughs> um but yeah no it's it's chill. oh i guess just the i don't really know what the 12 skaters do or the seniors do um, uh after probably school. a lot of drugs you think so i don't really yeah. i don't know no. you only find out once like you get close with them mm-hmm. i found out some dude like smoke cigarettes i was like that's crazy six yeah like just a rock like yeah, uh bro. like a like a 80 year old that's <laughs> like an 80 year old yeah bro i, I mean i look at that nick stuff yeah not, not good for dangerous. you bro They're not good for you i don't know i rock with it's because you know some people's lives are just different you mm-hmm. know that's why i don't really judge i used to judge like drug users but it's like yeah, you don't know no, you what don't, they went yeah. through it's just better to just let them like go bro exactly that's why like maybe yeah, smoke cigs bro i mean i don't know you Exactly. Like, like it's just, you I'll have your own. You have your own reasons for yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah, you know? yeah. What were you about to say? I was about to say, like, exactly. Like, you know, people tell me they there's there's stuff that they do, and like, I, I don't judge them for you know what mm-hmm. they do. I judge. I see like who they are as a person. It's not about like you know what you do and like, you know, the past. Yeah. I feel like you learn from your mistakes. Yeah. Was there anyone that like you knew that was like a hardcore like psych, psych? figure uh-huh. in game? In game. Yeah. Like they just like, I. They just saw pink and red all day. Like, they're just crazy. Like, yeah. Like, they were never off anything. There's a kid I know who's in game. He's always drinking mini shields. But out, like, out game, he's always drinking. Yeah. Like, just <laughs> mini shields, bro. Yeah. He's, he's, he's popping always, minis. Yeah. He's popping minis and, like, IRL? you could tell. Yeah. yeah. IRL. Oh, no, in game. <laughs> IRL, bro. Both. You feel me? Yeah, I feel you. I and feel so you. it's like, <laughs> once I'm doing period one, he popped a mini. I was like, okay. <laughs> he popped a mini. <laughs> okay, yeah, bro. bro. He's going to go on to big pots soon, I feel like. Big pots, bro. All right. Dude, so He's going to go big pots and it's going to be chug jugs. Chug jugs. He's going he's, he's to use the chug jug to like hit his teammates. Beat his teammates. Yeah, bro. Can't let that slide. Mm-hmm. But um, and what you were saying about like in-game, how some mm. of these kids are like, in game, they're yeah, uh, online med, med med kits and all that. Oh yeah, yeah. They take med kits. They take bandages. What else do they take? I don't know. What's that new? That new uh, the bush, the legendary bush. The, they take. <laughs> yeah, yeah, bro. <laughs> oh man, the generation like they just gotta learn. You know, mm-hmm. like things are not just gonna come to them. To be honest, they le- yeah, learn from everything. But like, what things. are the benefits? Because oh. everything has like of the new generation. What do you think? Well, obviously, you know, your mind. Because the newer kids, young, the, the newer generations are going to be smarter, bro. Like, mm. AI. Yeah, like all this stuff happening, like all the ways you can learn and stuff. Yeah, that is true, bro. Mm-hmm. Like I was thinking about it today. I've always heard like, oh, you have a computer in your pockets. But I didn't like think of it until today. I was like, mm-hmm. that's crazy. Like communicating with you, bro. I'd have to send you like a horse. Yeah, you could have like sent me like a poster, post mail, like, mm-hmm. you know, thou, you know, like King, <laughs> King Arjan of Bangladesh Kora. <laughs> like you would have done that bro yeah, instead of lagging like two hours you'd lag like six years and <laughs> get the yeah. <laughs> yeah bro my bad I, I no, did lag good, it a so little good. I lagged yeah, it a little good. today yeah. um, it gave us time to eat Shake Shack bro oh, wait that's <laughs> crazy I ate out <laughs> you ate Shake Shack and then you ate McDonald's yes bro Damn. that's cause I'm in the bulk <laughs> okay <laughs> the bulk yeah you've been hit in the gym uh, I just started again. Yeah. I accidentally lost 20 pounds, bro. Accidentally? Yeah, so what happened? I got sick. You mm-hmm. know how, like, when your parents tell you you're sick, you can't, like, you shouldn't do anything? Yeah. Like, they're like, oh, why are you on your phone? Yeah. Um, For the first time, I had a sickness where, like, I was... I was fatigued, and it was because of the gym. Mm-hmm. I was slightly fatigued the day before, and I had the choice to go to the gym. And I was like, I'm going to go. I'm going to stay dedicated. And that messed me up, because now my body had to... It's like it had limited energy and I just spent it on the gym and it couldn't use it to get itself better. And so I was sick. I was like, I couldn't do anything. I just felt horrible. Yeah. And then on top of that stuffy nose, I wasn't coughing, but like it just, everything felt bad. I felt ill. Like, I don't even want to say sick. I felt ill. And yeah. And I couldn't do anything, bro. I I couldn't, it was during Thanksgiving break, luckily. Mm -hmm. So like, I didn't like lose anything in terms of like school, but like I wanted to get on. No, bro. I didn't have the energy. Was it like that food poisoning? I don't know. I've never had food poisoning, no? so I, I don't know what that'd be like. But I just felt bad. Damn, bro. And you've had food poisoning? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Why? In my senior year, like, really, yeah, bro. I got no, sick for like. Scaring me, bro. I got sick <laughs> for like a week, bro. I, I lost like 15 pounds, really? and I was just hella skinny, like, 
I couldn't even move, bro. You know what it was? Tell what? Me. Guess what it was? It's, oh, a, okay. it's a chain. Okay. <laughs> it's a chain around here, you know, around the block. Around the block. Right here. In the valley, bro. Taco, I, Taco Bell, bro. Taco Bell? That Taco Bell uh, chicken quesadilla. <laughs> it was too authentic, bro. Bro, I don't know what was in Mexico. that, but I was I was on the I was on the shitter for like five uh, days, bro. Really? You know. How does it feel? It feels like. Are you dying. throwing up or? Uh, I threw up a couple times, you know. I, I couldn't uh, eat. That's why I was hella like skinny. Uh, but you know, you get the illness, and then you become ill after that. Ah. Uh, you know, yeah. for you <laughs> <like> that. <laughs> is is the uh, freshman thirty true? <laughs> I think it's freshman 15. But nah, 30. every year it increases, bro. <laughs> yeah, honestly. Yeah, I mean, it's true for some people. You know, don't, yeah. don't hate, you know. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. It, yeah, yeah, it is, bro. I, I can see it because you get free food, bro. Like, mm. Oh. Yeah, like, I'm not going to lie. I gained some weight, too, like, since, yeah, since I went to college. But, like, that's because I was been hitting the gym, too. Mm. So, but, yeah, you eat a lot. You know, you got a lot of free food. There's nothing to do. Mm. You know, so you're just like, yo, I'm just going to eat, go eat. Or like one of your homies like, hey, yo, let's go eat. Like just to do something. Or at least uh, in Merced, you know? Oh, yeah. What is like surrounding Merced? Bless you. <laughs> Nothing. Bless you. Was but that yeah. a sneeze? Nah, I don't think it was. I still bless people up just because. Bamboozled us. Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing in Merced, bro. Like, Really? Nah, bro. You just study. You go to the gym. Eat. Start a farm. Start a farm. We could do that, yeah. Take our agriculture class. Mm. Mm-hmm. Are there? What? Can I look it up real quick? Yeah. I just want to look up. Merced location Cause I have There's a nothing rough there Nothing Yeah like the school Is literally like A mile away from the city? the city too Yeah Really What's in the city The city Is literally Okay let me say Merced oh, This is what I heard Like um, There's a city next to it Called Atwater Atwater Yeah and Fresno Yeah you see Fresno That's like an, an hour away though Uh Okay But there's just like Zoom in There's a city next oh, to it yeah, Called Atwater. Atwater Yeah Chow Chilla And that was like The, the city before Merced and Merced was pretty much just like a place where like old people go and like die, or like you want to go and raise a family like in the quiet town. That's what the valley was. Yeah. All right. So, so then, it was just like that. Like you go there, you die, or you know, you go retire. You spend your retirement over there, and you go to Atwater. You live right next to it. Mm. But then they built the school there, and now it's being like gentrified, getting bigger. It's college students a lot. Like, uh, do people? <clears throat> Uh, what stories do you have? Like, ha- have you explored the city? Yeah, I have. I have. I've it, been a lot. I've been exploring a lot. There's uh, there's stores. You know, there's McDonald's, e Wingstop. A lot of people go to Wingstop. Uh huh. But like stores like L. A. Bro, no, nah. like, yeah, you know, I can imagine. Yeah, there's there's a there's like uh, events they have though, like where people come and like it's like a swap meet. They sell their old clothes like thrift mm. stores. Oh, that's pretty dope, bro. Like I got this Dior jacket. <laughs> Yeah, and this thrift store, bro, like, the yeah. homie hooked it up, bro. He's like, 30 bucks. And I was like, hell yeah. It was Vinci Dior, bro. You're Dior Dior? Dior Dior. Oh, uh, yeah, I got you, yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. And, yeah, bro. You meet, you meet, like, it's such a small city, bro, so you know, like, a lot of people. Mm. Like, you meet them again. Uh, is it more like a, like, is it similar to the valley in terms of, like, what it's like? or What, like, what it's like? I f- is it a I'm, suburb or? Is yeah, it's, it's, I see like, the, yeah, this kind of similar to the Valley because there's a lot of Mexicans. There's oh, really? A lot of Latinas. Oh, shoot. Latinos, Latinas. I saw your Spanish cut. <clears throat> like 20 times better? Mm, uh, yeah, a, un poquito, here. yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Poquito, poco, you know, poco, 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 un poco. Yeah, I got you, bro. <laughs> I've been learning Spanish a bit. Yeah? Yeah. You're not, I don't speak Spanish with my dad. Really? Uh, yeah, I. But he, But you understand what he said? Yeah. Okay, so, so here's the thing. No habla español, pero yo entiendo. Yes, sí, vale, 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 vale. Nah, vale so I, I didn't really learn. Well, I guess I did learn Spanish through my family, but I feel like I've learned more uh, on like people mm-hmm. around. Yeah, bro. Um, you, yeah, that's how I learned. Especially when I went to, I went you to Spain. Call mom. Oh shoot, yeah. It's all good, mom. Hold on, I'm in a. <laughs> you're I'm gonna, in a podcast. You're gonna mom. ignore your mom. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> I, I told. Yeah, I told. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, um, I went to Spain and I had to like speak Spanish and mm-hmm. I, I learned a lot. Like, vale. I started saying that. <laughs> vale. Vale. Just like, you tell me some like, Vale. So, vale, 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 compa. Yeah, com- you know, compa like, Adrian. Compa Adrian. Yeah. Tio Adrian, compa Adrian. Did you meet any ESL kids in, uh, in Poly? <laughs> Yeah, I met some ESL kids, but you know they were just like all jokesters. All the ESL yeah. kids, they just like you know like un rato, like oh it's for Kevin, like all that, and they were like, 
<laughs> yeah. We start laughing. They had like, the same like, laugh, bro. With their Adidas, Adidas uh, soccer pants. Uh-huh. The ones like that, that zip up. Yeah, and their Jordan 1 mids. The Jordan 1 mids with their uh, spray ground backpacks. Uh-huh. Yeah. And their, uh, what do you call it? The Ariat jackets. Ari- yes, bro. You already know. Yeah, it's bro. Crazy. This, this is the barrio right here, you know? Yeah. I've yeah. never... I met one, but like... Have you had classes with them or do you just know them through? No, nah, I didn't have classes mm. with anybody. Mm. When I was working, though, like I, I was... Also work, bro. Like I started learning Spanish, too. Really? Where yeah. Did you work? Oh. Panda? I worked at Panda, yeah. They spoke Spanish to you? Well, well like... the Bro, honestly, like my manager, he was kind of a weirdo. So he hired like... He'd hire girls that like... That only knew Spanish, too. Are you serious? Just because they were bad. Oh. Like, just because he thought they were pretty. Like, he was gonna, really? he hired them. Yeah. So he was like, I got so many, like, HR calls from him, like, to report him and everything. Really? Yeah. Oh, uh, and did he get fired? No, I mean, he's, he's just such a, bro, what he does is, like, he he earned so much money for Panda, so he's not gonna get fired. Wait, wait, when was this? This was when I was working. So, like, August, last, it's last summer. Oh. Uh, yeah, wait, but I'm pretty wait. sure, like, he still is, like, he's just a little weirdo, you know? This, pa- wait, a uh, Panda here? Uh, yeah, in Burbank. Oh, oh in Burbank. Uh, yeah, okay. but he probably he moved like moved locations because obviously like they don't want him to cause drama, so like, they move location. They mm. move to a different store. They but, always hide them. But they don't, you know. What if he's really at this panda? He used to be at the one right here. Oh really? Yeah, my homegirl told me she used oh. to work at Panda, and like he used to make her uncomfortable and everything. Oh. And like, bro, every time he like a girl walk in, like he like I'll just be minding my own business, you know. Like I'll be in the front like serving him. And like uh, like a good looking girl, like literally any good looking girl walking in, he'd be like, "Oh my god, this is why I love my job." <laughs> I'm like yo, what? I'm like that's yo, that's, that's a crazy thing to say. Yeah, like yeah, especially crazy. like when you're 33, you know. What with is a he? Wife and kid. Uh, he has a wife and kid. Yes. Wait, uh, what is he like? White. Black. He's Salvadorian. He's Salvadorian. Oh, yeah, he was shit. Salvadorian. That's crazy. Yeah, did he bro. speak Spanish? Or? Yeah, he did. That, that's why. But like, he hired girls that like speak Spanish because they're like right. the Latina baddies, you know. Yeah. But, like, they were really cool. Like, when I actually, you know, I was like, oh, mm-hmm. like, oh, Adi, Adi, like, they're the, they're the homegirls, but that boy, he was a weirdo, but yeah. he always used to flirt with them. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. I think the Cluck and Blaze manager has the same problem, bro. <laughs> I feel like if <laughs> you don't Cluck know... and Blaze is weird, bro. It's a money laundering <laughs> place. So. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's, it's like, like a money 2024 BMW outside. Yeah, outside bro, with the AMG, <laughs> AMG package bends. You know, and they're over here getting one customer every hour. <laughs> Something's up, bro. Something's up. I feel like if you don't know Spanish half the time, like, you won't be able to order. Cause I know. Because they have, like... He's actually a good immigrants. guy, though. Like, he's a cool guy. Yeah? Yeah. He left, and then he came back. Oh, you're talking about the Armenian, right? Yeah, the big Armenian guy. Mm. Yeah. Big, like the, like the... Like, he's just, like, huge. Like, tall, big. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Because uh, there was this one, like... I don't know if he was Armenian, but he had, like, a lazy eye. Back when Click and Blaze first opened. I think so. I don't know. He like a, be- a tall beard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah I think yeah. that's the one. Oh, you're talking about cool. him? Yeah. Yeah, I don't but think it's still, it's too expensive over there. Yeah, man. okay. One is With a little amount of food. That's that's why they uh, afford looking, those. It's beers. looking mid. Like, it's mid. Yeah, you think so? Yeah. So, um, what's it called? Uh, that, that guy with the lazy eye? I haven't seen him around in so long. I think in like a year and yeah. a half. Yeah. It's always... He got too lazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Like the lazy eye just went to the lazy body. In the lazy legs. That's smart, yeah. Yeah. Ten times. Yeah, and the only dude I see consistently is like some Armenian dude. And, uh, and dude, they're every, taking over the yeah, valley. Every time I, <laughs> <laughs> every time I learned about Armenian history, I get like I feel more and more bad for them. Hey man, me too. I mean, I I learned about, but I went to Madison, bro. It was a school full of Armenians. Really? Yeah, like I know about like the ni- like nineteen fourteen, right? March. Mm. Like oh, nice oh wait uh, yeah was it when like Turkey, yeah, all that yeah. I only I know one Armenian homie. The uh, first episode. Yeah. Hovik. Yeah, Hovik. that dude. He um, yeah he because t- his brother posted something about it. I was like, that's crazy, dude. If you want to meet some Armenians, just go to Glendo. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, how many are there? Oh, the Glendo is is the town. You know, that's where you go find them and meet meet some homies. Yeah. Yeah. Are, are they racist? What are they like? Uh, I don't really know. I can't really. That's, I don't want to be racist, bro. <laughs> I'm just curious. Uh, like, if you. One word to describe Armenians. One word to Armenian. describe Armenians. Um, money. Mm. Money. That's because we only see the rich ones. Think about that. Yeah. Society. But I, to, I, didn't they get money? They didn't get money for the government? Really? Yeah. For what? For the Turkey thing. 
Uh, by American government? Yeah. Really? Like, I think it was like, yeah, they got money from How America. Much? Okay, bro, I don't know. Like, you got to fact check this. Cause, oh, yeah, fact check. Yeah, because I think they got money from the government. Like, they got That's why they have, like... What was that? That was my phone. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Pray. Oh, my mom said... Well, my mom said you want Chick-fil-A. Hold on, let me say yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's why she was calling. Hey, but... Oh, what was I saying? Yeah, like, I heard they got money for the government. That's why they had, can afford houses and, like, they can come here, you know. Good. That's why a lot of them came here. They can afford the AMGs? AMG Beamers. Mercedes, I make it. Claro, so uh, it's a classic. Yeah. Since 1992, uh, the US government gave Armenia for the army, uh, like for uh, reparation for the Armenian government, $3.3 billion. That's a, that's crazy. You know, that's why, bro. No wonder yeah. that ex- no wonder Cluck and Blaze exists. Yeah, like, that's a lot. It's <laughs> <laughs> a lot of money, bro. That's why they got the Beamers, Benzes. <laughs> Everything, man. The they houses should. in the Burbank Hills. I wish they put it into like more businesses, more cluck mm-hmm. and blazes. <laughs> more cluck and blaze. More cluck and blaze. Who blaze. controls the world? More Macy's kebabs. Yeah. Kebab. Have you, do you know any authentic kebab places? Mm-hmm. Authentic? Yeah. Do I have to go to Yerevan? Uh, there's just one place in the Panorama Mall, Loki. Like, I don't know if it's authentic, but it, it slaps. It's ran by like 12 black dudes. It is? <laughs> no, mm-hmm. no, no, no. I saw... <laughs> yeah, um, there's not... I think I said this before. There's not enough black people in the valley. Is that, there's not really, honestly. Uh, Once you go to college, bro, like, or for me, Merced, like, it's actually, it's actually pretty diverse. Yeah? You know? so. Yeah, there's a lot of people from, like, Kenya and, like, Africa. Oh, really? There's exchange students from, Ke- like, China, oh, too, and stuff. And, Do you like, talk to them? Yeah. Bro, I'm like a very like outgoing, like extroverted mm, yeah, guy. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like literally like I I hear like I have my window open, bro, and I hear like the people under me, like loud as fuck playing UFC. I'm like, what the fuck? Like I used to hear every night, and then like they used to they used to hit their bong right under me. So <laughs> they hit their bong, and then the fucking smoke goes up in my room. I'm like, damn, like you guys are hotboxing. Like, and I I was like, you know, what? I'm just gonna go downstairs and say what's up. Uh-huh. <laughs> like this is what I think, and I'm like. I went down. I was like, "Yo, bro, like, y'all smoking, bro?" And he's like, and then he thought he, he thought I was like the uh, like ops. <laughs> he thought I was the ops, bro. He's like, "Wait, bro, are you?" He's like, "Are you an RA?" Like, <laughs> and I was like, "Nah, bro, I'm literally live above." Me. He's like, "Oh yeah, bro, you're in my class." And he's like, "What's up?" And then he let me slide, and like we we're playing UFC and everything. Like, uh, things just happen, you know. Uh huh. Life's so random, bro. Yeah. Life yeah. Is, uh, my um, <sighs> no one ever told me this. I just came up with it right now, bro. But life is like a. Like box of chocolates yeah i don't get that how does that work life is like a box like of you get eaten or what do they mean by that uh you pick the good ones and you leave the bad ones mm, we're <laughs> all brown inside <laughs> we're all brown inside outside some of us yeah yeah uh, so deep down deep down um what's i gonna say you're gonna talk about like how smart i am oh not <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's your gpa right now my gpa right now in yeah. college uh uh-huh. Oh, I, was, I know what oh. I was going to ask you about. Okay, book you good? It's a 3.5. You know, it could have been better. I failed. I got to see. Actually, I didn't fail, but got to see in discrete math. 79%, bro. What's discrete math? Oh, my God. Don't get me started, bro. Like, you have to take it when you're comp sci. Uh, and it's basically, like, converting the equations to, like, English kind of, like, if P, then Q. Mm. Like, if this is going to happen, then this will happen pretty much. If it's Q like then P. a bunch of equations and like a bunch of laws, like mm. probability laws. Like if this will happen, then that will happen. And like you have to learn all the signs. Philippians 16.9. <sighs> yeah, bro. That's crazy. So I don't well, know how it was I like difficult. Oh. Yeah, no, actually, I do know how I passed, bro. You, you hustled? I hustled for the week, a week and a half. I was like, my final was coming up. I had a 70%. And I was like, if I f- the final was 50% of my grade, bro. Yeah. And, like, our teacher, our professor was so ass. Like, he he was just... Like, okay, let me say this. <laughs> I like, just realized what you said. <laughs> okay. My professor, bro, like, he had a, he was Indian. He had a strong Indian accent. Uh-oh. And he was talking about converting equations back to English. So I was like, bro, like, what? So, like, it started, like, first class, we had, like, 200 kids. And then he broke his toe. And he started doing Zoom classes. <laughs> but, like, he would just read off the slides. Oh, my God, bro. He used to just read off the slides. And, like, people were just like, bro, like, I can't even understand it. Like, what's the point? Like, he's just going to read off the slides. And I was like, bro, like, 
<laughs> Nobody went to class after that. He came back from his uh, toe. Uh-huh. And his class, like, I went once, bro. There was, like, 10 people in there. <laughs> there was, like, 10 people in there, and, like, nobody uh, went. And, like, the last week where, like, finals were out, I saw, like, the whole class in the library. <laughs> like, all, like, a bunch of the kids from the class. Uh, and, like, they came up to me, like, yo, like, is that just Green Matthew studying for? And I was, like, yeah, like, and they're, like, bro, like... Like, bro, fuck him. Like, he's the worst teacher <laughs> ever. Like, like I don't know why he's like... Bro, if you're doing discrete math, like, go on YouTube, guys. Like, search up Kimberly Bram. That's the best teacher ever. Kimberly <laughs> like, Bram. Kimberly Bram is the best professor. How do you say the last one? Bram. Like, B-R- Bram? Yeah, B-R-E-H-M. Oh, H-M, Bram. Yeah, she's, like, some Utah professor, bro. But uh, she has some fire-ass YouTube videos. Yeah. And that's how I learned. Like, that's how I passed the class. Mm. And and also were like the Indian Avengers assembled in the library. Oh, so there's a bunch of Indian dudes, like all the computer science majors, really? try hards, man, and then uh, they're like, like oh, they get in here, bro. And then we all came up with like some Avenger plan, you know. We all sat next <laughs> to each other and like went crazy, bro. Shout, shout out, shout out, brown people. Yeah. Shout, <laughs> yeah. IIT. <laughs> what? Have you heard of IIT? I oh, Indian, Indian trade tech in, or no, Indian, Indian technical. Yeah, something like that. What's MIT? Mm. Massachusetts Institution of Technology. Technology. Indian oh. Institution of Technology. Yeah. yeah. Shout out. Shout out. Um, oh, I was going to ask you about um, frats, bro. Frats. Are you affiliated? I'm not affiliated right now. Oh, okay. But I'm What you know about be. Phi Kappa Theta? Phi Kappa Theta. Only the real ones are part of Phi Kappa Theta. I know about Phi Kappa Theta. Yeah. You know, it's a <clears throat> Criminal pretty well known frat, you know. Yeah. Criminal organization. They should all link up. Like if, like, let's say there's like Sigma Alpha Sigma Alpha Sigma in one school, it should be associated with. The that's one. what they do, bro. They do. Yeah. That's oh, what so they there's do. like an international league. Is there an na- international, international, international? Yeah. Yeah. Like there's like one like I know for the one that I'm joining, they have like their main thing like in Virginia and like all the presidents like they have to go in Virginia and like. Are you serious? Yeah, and then one they have like an event, where like frat events. So you can meet up with other, like, like if you're joining, like, Kappa Alpha, you know, like, you're in Kappa Five Alpha, Kappa and, like, you see Kappa Alpha, like, a flag somewhere else, and you can say, what's up? Like, hey, guys, like, I'm a brother, too, at this, uh, blah, blah, blah. And they're like, oh, my God, bro, I'm a brother. And then we're like, let's go, brothers. <laughs> and, like, brothers, brother, we got to do this, brother. And then, you know, you become a brother. Oh, uh, that's crazy. Have you watched Iron Claw? Iron Claw? The no, movie, bro. What is it? It's about brothers. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's like a really good movie. I recommend bonds. it. Yeah, bro. Okay. Where where can I watch that? Uh, you could watch it on AMC. Wow. You could watch it in the movie theaters. I, I miss Zac there. Efron in there. Zac Efron? I've Zac heard Efron. Of him. To be honest, I don't really watch movies. You know, I watched Oppenheimer for the first time like two days ago. I know ago. what happened. What happened? Like you watch Oppenheimer and then you were like, I need to make a bomb? Yeah, like yeah. I started, uh, I decided my major was going to be in quantum physics. Wow. Very powerful movie. Huh? I saw someone um in a comment section once. I was like, I started focusing on my math class after watching the movie. Hey, bro, like, that's crazy. Yeah, he, he does some crazy stuff. Some so smart you people gotta out be there. insane to do that stuff. Like, there's some yeah, like bro. LeBron James, LeBron James of quantum physics. Yeah, that's yeah. crazy. LeBron th- James is everything if you think about it, bro. Yeah, and there's yeah. the LeBron James is gonna get just keep getting better, you know, as it ages. Yeah, you know, we should have LeBron wine. LeBron one. Wine. Wine? Yeah. Low-key, bro, I, I found out, like, if you're a billionaire, mm-hmm. let's say you just had a billion dollars, you could start, like, a hundred companies. And, like, it's, like, the whole thing where, like, only one needs to succeed to pay everything else off. You could just keep doing that. Yeah. Bro. You think you're, like, a billionaire. Yeah. I, I mean. With negative 200 in my bank right now. Negative 200. But I'm almost there. Yeah, I mean, bro, it's, look, as it's negative two, at least it's not negative three hundred. Yeah, bro, always exactly. Think about just think like that. And then when it's just a negative three hundred, bro, at least it's not four hundred. Yes, bro. You know, I always got to keep a positive mindset. You know, yeah. So you get through this life. Mm-hmm. You know, with That's, all those ups and downs. You know, that is. Do you believe in stoicism? Stoicism. Yeah, or stoicism. Uh, isn't that like the philosophy thing? Like, but yeah, whatever happens, happens. Yeah. Honestly, you get I shot. Do. That's just part of life. It's part of life. Like yeah. if I die, to, if I die right now, I get wall banged through this garage <laughs> door. Then it's just part of life, you know. Like it's just gonna happen. Smoke, you know? Yeah. Yeah. This my garage door, and you. <laughs> yeah. I lose everything, bro. Yeah, bro. Like whatever happens. Like if you put some cr- something in that <laughs> that coffee, like it was meant to be, bro. You start seeing like three <laughs> D. No, that's why I'm asking already, cause like I'm tripping. Oh uh, yeah. You yeah, seeing, bro. Yeah. I'm already tripping. What'd you uh-huh. put in there? 
I put the uh, UFC fighter serum. Yeah. Yeah, the UFC Dope. fighter serum. Bro, that's why I wanted like to like do a left hook right now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I knew it. Have you heard of? Uh, where were you during the World Cup? Wait, were you still in Poly? Yeah, you were. Right. The World Cup, the recent World yeah. Cup. Yeah. Yeah. Now the one. Oh yeah. yeah! Holy shit, bro! You just you, I, you just gave me a memory, bro. World yeah. Cup, like in Mister O's class, we used to always watch really? the games. He used to put it up on the. Yeah, bro, it was oh, so sick. dope, bro. We just be like, yo, no way! And then like they won, and Mister O was like, like he's sad, and he just started the <laughs> lesson, bro. He was like, whatever, bro, and then he's like, all right, quiz, and then <laughs> I think he was a quiz, but like, that was a good day, bro. Like, Why was he sad? <laughs> well. Oh, wait, who won World Cup again? Like, I forgot uh, about teams. Argentina won, huh? Yeah, like the or bracket Messi? was? It was Messi? Yeah, Messi, Argentina, yeah. Yeah, bro. Like, I, I don't even remember the World Cup. Like, I just remember watching it in the class. Like, it was just such a good vibe. Yeah, bro. Mm. And, like, all the all the days in class were just, like... My senior year was pretty chill, like, you know? Yeah. Just chill. That's crazy how I'm a senior now. You're a senior now, bro. That's, you gotta stay on your stuff. Have yeah, you been stressing? I'm gonna be honest, no. No? School-wise, no. Nothing, bro? Like... What well, are you plan? Like, I'm gonna ask you this. Like, what do you plan to do in the future, man? Because in the future, yeah, honestly, like it comes by fast, bro. It's already yeah. January. You're gonna graduate soon. I, low key, like I don't know. I feel like I'm taking things one at a time. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know if that's good or bad, though. Um, yeah, I mean, you could take things one at a time, but I feel like you just do research. You know, like if you like something, do research about it. See if you like it even more. Like, mm. like the in, you know, if you like, like that a meth dealer. Yeah, like a meth dealer, you know? Like, if you like weed, like, see if you like it even more. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but... We're gambling, right? Yeah, you gambling, yeah. too much. Yeah, <laughs> bro. Like, like, think about it like this. In gambling, like, you're always gonna... You know, there's gonna be diamonds behind the wall one, you know, at least once. Yeah. Yeah. I learned that through Minecraft. And mm-hmm. Yeah, that's just... Good to go to Y11. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's where you find the diamonds. That's actually Y negative 64, I think. Is negative 64 now? Yeah, right. Caesar? Uh, you find diamonds on negative Y negative sixty four, right? Look up, look up optimal diamond location. It's gonna tell them the blackjack casino. <laughs> In Minecraft, yeah. Um. Oh well, yeah, the OG was eleven. The old head season. Oh, I love Kathy. Yeah, I had a problem. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> huh? No, but like optimal. See, twelve and below, bro. No, like, I don't believe that. Like you could go Y eleven to find it, bro. But I told bro, you. The newest update between Y level sixteen and negative sixty four. Yeah, see negative sixty. See, I was in there. I was Y eleven. <laughs> You're close enough. Yeah. Wait, sixty through negative sixty four. Sixteen. Oh. Oh, okay. I think Prime is negative sixty four though, because I don't know. That's no, that's Logan Paul's drink. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it was almost here. It didn't make it. Yeah, no, it's not. That you know, <laughs> um, they were selling it for one dollar at GNC. Damn. And so I bought a whole pack. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Damn, this guy loves Prime. Yeah, bro, like, <laughs> <laughs> it was um, he applied the deal to the the whole box, so, so it was, it was, it was like twelve dollars. Twelve bucks. Normally that it's ain't thirty. Bad. That's some energy though, like you know. That's not energy. If you've been hitting the gym, that'll be good. Some prime. It's actually worse, I think, because it's just a bunch of potassium. I think it's literally just juice. But isn't a banana a bunch of potassium? Yeah, you don't need to eat bananas if you drink prime. Oh yeah. Same thing. You could just liquidize everything. Oh yeah, that's the yeah. thing. I'm I think again, in the future, like they'll just liquidize everything yeah. and have like robots just make it for you. Yeah, AI. Yeah. I had vending machine pizza in Spain. Yeah. It was good. It was good. Yeah, very good. Vending machine? Yeah, vending machine pizza. I think they had like a like a machine in the back make it. Like it there was no like mold on it when you got it? No. No? <laughs> Maybe that's what gave it the flavor though. Oh yeah. You can't judge. Like blue cheese? I swear I'm addicted to blue cheese. I don't get that line. Oh. Pass on my sign, it's a movie. Okay. Walked in. No. What song is that? <laughs> oh yeah. Walked in. Dun, 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 who who is that music artist? Is uh, it, is it designer? Nah, I don't know. No. I don't I know some, some New York drill artist Um, But uh, yeah And so mm. What was I gonna say Oh No I forgot already Oh the prime Oh yeah so um, I'm gonna give my kid an iPad mm-hmm. At the age of two And I'm gonna just give them liquid For everything To have them optimally grow So baby food 
Oh yeah. <laughs> no, but like even when they're older, like if they want like n- nuggets, I just like liquidize it. Yeah. And then like, so, and then at the end of the day, you save money. Like when they're yeah. older, because yeah. they get used to the liquid food, so they don't want solid food or any exactly. like fast food. Yeah. So then we're like, oh, well, like let's go get. <laughs> Let's go get McDonald's, you know, and then you can be like, no, son, like we gotta liquidize it. <laughs> and then you're like, oh, like okay, and he tries to run away, uh, but yeah, like I'm gonna force him to sleep eight hours and thirty two minutes every day or something. Like I'm gonna optimally grow them. No, you can't. I oh. charge. <laughs> oh. I haven't drank water. Are drink you a water. fan of? Um, I'm a fan of water. Are you a fan of Tami and Paula? I am a fan of Tami and Paula. That's it. You see that? I used to think it was like a group of 20 people. You know, that album I thought was like 30 years old. And how old is it? Like six years? Yeah, it's not that old, bro. Yeah, I thought it was 30, bro. It looks like it looks old. Yeah, bro. He's talking about this guy, by the way. Huh? Oh, I'm going to show the camera. Like that album, you know? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm a fan of T- Tim and Paula. I'm a fan of a lot of music, bro. I- I'm really like very diverse guy. Diverse. You know? like, like Merced? I- yeah. <laughs> yeah, like Merced. <laughs> You know, I I like every I like a lot of things. You know, just one thing I can't listen to country, bro. I can't. No, that's one thing I can't listen no to. No matter like. No matter what, what like about, I I just can't like nah, huh? like riding on the tractor. You know, no matter you know. But like, those songs go hard, bro. Okay, it yeah, like, it, like okay, they got the bars, but bro, like I can't relate. You know, like <laughs> yeah, I, I think I never, it's kind of too slow. No, I never like you know rode my tractor or you know killed some deers, so. Or be racist. <laughs> I'm be racist That's just what they talk about But like I'm not saying no. either Like you know Like the rapper songs They talk about killing people Like you know uh, I kill someone But <laughs> It's just like In game you can Yeah Yeah Exactly you know What about Peso Pluma Peso Pluma Oh yeah. I, I am a big fan of Peso Pluma I went yeah. to his concert the, in, Say In Puro Stockton uh. You know That's how That's how I like uh, Spanish I know a little Spanish Cause of like I listen to a lot of Spanish songs Oh really Yeah Who's your favorite Spanish music artist? Favorite? I don't... Ooh, look at like... It's gonna be really, like, you know, generic, but, like, obviously, like, I like, you know, Eslabon. I like the sad, like, the sadder, like, cumbia, Sassier. you know, like, cumbia yeah. torado. Cumbia, what is it? Uh, corrido. Corrido. Corrido tumbados. tumbados yeah, that's 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 yeah. yeah, you know? Uh, do you rock with the Malo Conejo? Malo Conejo? Yeah. Que es esto? The Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny? Oh, yeah, yeah. The album? Yeah, yeah. My boy Benito? Uh-huh. Yeah, I fuck with Benito. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like a I love a Latina girl. They like Benito. That's just Chico. You get that Chico. Okay. Start wearing his merch. Yeah, like, yeah. Wear the toy shirt on the bed. I'm already on that. Come on. <laughs> yeah, bro, but yeah, I like Benito. Um, I got you. Mm-hmm. No, I like to, you know, like, La Playa de Noche. You uh, know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's my first time ever. Noche de vida. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. Hey, you could look his sub for him. I could sub probably. Yeah. To, yeah. Maybe Peso Pluma Stockton. too, you know? Yeah. Like That's a Stockton translator? Yeah. He was like, he's like, escúchame. <laughs> Con la patula. Bro, you look, s- huh? Uh, well, uh, wait, what were you saying? No, I was saying, like, <laughs> I, was, yeah, I think it's close to what you're about to say, but. Yeah, uh, he was saying a lot of stuff, and I didn't understand. But it was, it was crazy. <laughs> yeah, you just need to hear yelling. Yeah, just to understand. And like, yeah, bro. I th- Latinos they have a lot of energy. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Like that. Because the perico. <laughs> <laughs> the perico, the cerveza, <laughs> con todo, man. <laughs> yeah, bro. bro. Yeah. yeah, it's like it, I love the energy, bro. It's, yeah. It was so loud in there. It was Sick. like just dope. Or how yeah. many music artists have you seen in st- like in, like in, in person the area? No, like since you went to Merced. I seen OGZ. OGZ pulled up to. Who's OGZ? From Shoreline Mafia. Oh. You know? Do they still exist? Yeah. Yeah, they exist. Oh, okay. I mean, he was there. So, <laughs> so I think he exists. Like the, the group, like the band? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because yeah. it was a group, right? Mm hmm. Yeah. yeah, they exist. You know who? You know, like Musty. Mm. I'm a little. Dumb. I'll be honest, I never. He's like some gangster guy. Ah. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> you know who um, the group that kind of fell off was. Um, I think they completely disassembled Brockhampton. Brockhampton. Yeah. Man, yeah, they're good. They're really good. Didn't yeah. they disassemble because like they all had like problems? I will, I would not know. I think they did. I heard a couple of their songs, but yeah. Yeah. Um, I was never really a fan. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be honest. I don't even know what. I, oh, bro, I used to love the weekend. Yeah. What do you listen to now? Like. Peso Pluma. You listen to Peso, Peso Pluma? Pluma? Yeah, yeah bro. Uh, that, my Spanish also increased because of him. Yeah. What's your favorite song? Uh oh, shoot. 
Oh, uh, shit. He doesn't know uh, what to say. I don't know. Because <laughs> they're also amazing. Mm-hmm. No, you um, don't like... Don't be lady. Yeah, don't be lady. 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 Don't this is so, such bars like and then it makes me learn the spanish too because uh, it helps bro like to learn spanish i feel like you gotta learn like people try to learn the vocabulary you know like the mm. vocab like how to say stuff like like, like with people like you know like do yo usted usted all yeah. that stuff but you just gotta learn the action verbs yeah because then once you learn the verbs then you could just like add the stuff on to it's like a program you look you just gotta, gotta like, go in program. raw yeah like you just gotta just like, going raw, you know. If it breaks, it breaks. Yeah, get yeah. in a conversation with like a group of, or like natives. you know the or padres, you know. Yeah, compadres. Yeah, yeah. Like, yes, yeah. I walk into that ESL class. Yeah, and then you right. get roasted by then, and then you <laughs> learn. You, like, <laughs> you start with the you start learning with the bad words, and then you get mm. into the real language. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I want to walk into an ESL class. That seems what's, what's stopping you. Yeah, no, I don't know, nothing. Do like, you think it's different, like nationally? Just be like, so your room, belly gone, <laughs> and then walk in. Yeah, bro. Be like, puro belly gone, pinches, pinches peso pluma. A la verga. Yes. <laughs> Shout out AJ Volton, bro. You should watch that. Who? AJ Volton. AJ Volton? What yeah, is bro. that? He's a YouTuber. Oh. Uh. Yeah, he's pretty funny, bro. He does yeah. like peso pluma pranks, like uh. el belly gone oh. pranks. <laughs> Yeah. Like does he walk like in, he like, walks in like he's a taquache like, oh. taquache <laughs> fit and he's like he's like hey like your mama lona like, <laughs> yeah, like he just acts like he just acts stupid Aren't bro the- it's like what my homie was saying like he does stuff like what you think in your head you know like yeah. to the random people he's like he goes up to like the bota store and he's like do you guys have any boots made of ant leather <laughs> so, like, they're like what ant leather <laughs> yeah bro that's crazy you know, you know that? I, ant leather boots? You don't have any? Is that <laughs> <No>. <laughs> it just says random stuff, bro. <laughs> he's ant leather, bro. And they look at him like, and he's like, oh, like, and then he goes to like to the belt store, and he's like, he goes to look at the belt, bro, and he's like, you think this is like a, a good belt? And he's like, they're like, oh yeah, it's a really good belt. And he's like, here, like, and then he starts like, f- like flexing. He's like, he's like, I, I need one for my toxic pinche Kimberly, and he starts like whipping the floor. He's like, oh, <laughs> And then like, yo, what? <laughs> he's like, oh yeah, this one's good. This one's very sturdy. And then he's like, I'm gonna take this one. Uh-huh. Uh, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, What's his bro. name? AJ, AJ Volta. AJ. <laughs> yeah, bro. Aren't um aren't the quatches from Stockton? I think uh, so. <laughs> I, I don't think they're just from Stockton. <laughs> you know, they're from Texas. You know, there's. I mean, like originally. I think that's originally, what. Originally, um, I don't know, bro. I think I think originally they're just from Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> and then they like came over here. Yeah, I mean, there's there's taquaches everywhere, bro. Hey, do you know Bengali? Do I know Bengali? Yeah. yeah. Like, if I had a conversation with you right now, would you be able to like perfectly respond? Do you know Bengali? No. Oh yeah, <laughs> bro. Why would I? <laughs> yeah, my parents speak Bengali. Uh, yeah. Do Do you know the alphabet? Bengali alphabet? No, I don't yeah. know how to write Bengali mm. or read it. I just yeah. know it. I know <laughs> how to read and write Spanish. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but not Bengali, bro. Yeah, because uh, most of the time when people, well, at least according to Muhammad, they just use the English alphabet. But like, exactly, bro. Yeah, but like you know how to speak it. Like if, if especially if you're like Americanized, you know, more Westernized, bro. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Have you went back? I went back in when I was little in 2009. Mm-hmm. That was my first time going. First and only. Or first and only. Oh really? Uh, my parents went in 2017 again, but they gave me like you know. Uh, that dilemma like or not dilemma but they gave me an option you know to go back or buy a new pc <laughs> so you already know your boy bought a new pc <laughs> yeah i was not about to go back <laughs> bro the tickets are like 12 like 1200 dollars bro really oh yeah so i'm like bro 1200 dollars for a ticket or 1200 dollars for a new pc that'll last me like six years and yeah i picked the right decision that's crazy <laughs> and i got that pc it's because the first time i went like at least like where i went bro like it just stunned like straight fish Smell like fish yeah. everywhere, and like I was like, bro. You remember? Yeah. Two thousand nine. I was a little, I was a little shit running around, but like still. Yeah, I remember like the house. We had like a big ass house over there. Oh really? Yeah. 
because of the money here or did um, you guys just well they yeah well they i mean they, they had like money back there that's how we got here you know uh. like my whole family so but that's like my grandpa's still trying to sell his house over there because mm. it's just like wasting up land mm. and like he's not no one lives over there anymore all my whole family like my mom's okay. side my mom's side lives in new york oh, like, really? oh yeah my new york oh. like michigan that's why i go there sometimes and then yeah on my dad's side like they all moved here to cali mm. so yeah bro we have a pretty big family i find it crazy how like some people just move from countries that far exactly bro like low-key if you're from mexico it's just so easy exactly and they have to learn english like all this stuff you know it's just crazy yeah yeah bro like my grandparents they moved from they actually moved from bangladesh to london first oh really yeah and they got the citizenship in london and then from london they came here Ah. and like once they came here you know you could bring your wife with that green card and they could bring other family members and then the whole gang you know Mm. Started repopulating. That's how. That's how Armenians got in too. Yeah. <laughs> they <came over. laughs> yeah, bro. They just started in Glendale on Burbank. Oh, yeah. so is Glendale a region and Burbank is a city? I don't get how that works. Basically, Glen Bur- I know Bur- Burbank's not part of LA County because yeah, no. yeah, it's their own city. Like they have their own rules and like Burbank police, they're way more strict than yeah. LA because it's like their city. You know. Yeah, they, 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 they don't like homeless. My mom's job is like half. LA half Burbank Mm -hmm. and like sometimes there's homeless like they put the homeless to one side because they're allowed to stay in the LA part but Burbank no yeah exactly bro I used to work in the Burbank one bro and then all the Burbank like offices I used to come in all the time I used to ask her and like one time there's like some homeless guy hiding the dumpsters bro and they deadass like had the guns out like on him (laughs) get out of the dumpsters I was like I was just like trying to clean like my freaking store bro I just see them with guns out and shit I had so many times to call the police bro uh, yeah, good times though. Mm. But yeah, bro, Burbank. Uh, I think I think Glendale is also like their own city too. But really? yeah, no, is it their own city or I know it's part of LA? Like, yeah, I just know there's a bunch of Armenians there. That's all I know. You should learn Armenian for them. You yeah, know, I know Armenian. Ara ara, ara sukle bara. Che, I know che. Shuk shuk me bara, ara javlatte. How do you learn that, bro? Shush me na. Uh, me now. Yeah, I, I, from <laughs> Madison, bro. I'm telling you, knowledge is power, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know really. No, I don't know Armenian. Sorry, guys. Uh, that was just like some bad words I learned. Oh, okay, for yeah. sure. And they're always like, Arra, Arra. Arra, Arra, Susma, Arra. What is it? Arra? Oh, wait, Arra, Susma, Arra. No, they, they like to say Arra a lot. Like, arra, 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 Arra. I don't know what Arra means. Arra, pa, 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 pa. Arra, Arra, Sukla. Arra, Sukla. Someone told me, I think it was Muhammad. Yeah. Well, I don't know why Muhammad is brought up like twenty times. He was just <laughs> he's on the my goat. Mind. Yeah, yeah, bro. Look, yeah he, he's cracked at soccer, bro. Uh, he's cracked at fantasy. Yeah, fantasy basketball. Fantasy basketball. That he be like getting undefeated. the good prize picks. <laughs> he's undefeated. Yeah. On our, we have like a little. He'd be league. making his bank. Huh? <laughs> Damn. His twelve cents. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, was it him? Someone told me. I forgot. Yeah. Oh, I think he told me that shit too. <laughs> he literally told me the same thing. He was like, "Bro, yeah," and I was like, "Bro, you're so right." Like, <laughs> That's true though. Like, you just gotta think about it. Like I always thought about it. Like uh, every day, I think about what he said, and I'm like, "Dude, like this guy's the most like you know influential person." Mm-hmm. That's where he got his name, Mohammed. Yeah. <laughs> What's it called? Um, well, I think the Armenians also speak Russian. I think mm-hmm. some. Yeah, Privyet. Privyet. Because uh, Russian, hey. Nahoy? Nahoy. Uh, I don't know. Blat. I started saying blat after like, if yeah. I'm ever mad, I'm just like blat. Feel me? I just learned Duolingo. Blat? Okay. Blat. I think blat. 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 <laughs> okay. Bro. I go crazy with the what Russian, the hell bro. What are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> you can say blat, bro. I, I'm like private. Yeah. <laughs> that's like, that's as close as I can get. Privyat. 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 That's how the Japanese would say it. Uh, you be watching anime? Nah. I no. used to I used to watch Japanese streamers for some reason. During Japanese quarantine, streamers? I'd just be so bored, I'd look at different languages. <laughs> That's kind of where like I picked up like that <laughs> little blood. That's okay. I would watch like random like I watched he French watched, streamers like, Pewdie- too. PewDiePie, bro, like he'd be saying some stuff <laughs> in Swedish Swedish. Swedish, yeah. He said he kind of forgot some of it. Yeah, he's yeah. in Japan now. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. His kid's going to be Japanese. Yeah. That's insane. Mm-hmm. I heard they're xenophobic in Japan. Mm-hmm. Like, like pretty, 
they ask you like, when are you leaving? It's like, mm-hmm. if I do that, Japan's very strict, um, bro. Yeah, they are. I'm gonna go there well one day. Really? Yeah, I, it's a dream. Uh, it's on the bucket list, mm, Japan, just yeah. to go like like all the onsen and stuff. Mm, what's an onsen? It's like Where's a hot that spring. That? Hot spring. Ah, yeah. the one naked. Yeah, you gotta get naked. You gotta get jacked first. Yeah, sure. yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's what we're working on, you know. Just for that, that's why I'm doing it. Yeah, that's why you're eating McDonald's right now, so that uh-huh. when you lose it all. It's just it's all exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I heard there's xenophobic. Oh, uh, yeah, I'd watch, like, streamers in random languages, like, French or, or Japanese. It was just so interesting how, like, these people are just completely different. Well, if you think about it, languages are crazy. Like, you know, you just, once you get born into, like, a family, bro, you learn that language. And it's, like, the language you're stuck with, you know, wherever you're born. And everyone else has their own way of communicating. Yeah, bro. Yeah. Like, ants, you know, like, they communicate with their antennas and stuff. Oh, yeah, like, like their bees. leather. Yeah, antennas. and, like, you know, yeah. cats have their own language. Yeah. Yeah. Is it language or more like like yelling? Like if I were to yell, like you can't, you don't know specifically what I'm saying, but you could kind of judge based on my emotion. If you yell? Yeah, like if I'm like, ah, like I think that's what meowing huh? is. Cats? Yeah. Cats don't meow to other cats. They don't? They only hiss at other cats. Cats only meow to humans. Yeah, but like they have a some telekinetic, <laughs> yeah, know, telekin- something like Travis where they Scott? understand each other, yeah. Like Travis they listen Scott? to some SZA, they're like telekinesis. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Yeah. Nah, um, but you probably... <laughs> Like your best friend or something probably speaks like Mandarin or Punjabi. What? He does? Yeah, pro- maybe somewhere out there, like the the most like closest match to you. Like you my like the know. like the wifey like yeah like, know, like wife like, like, like perfect think, like so many like you, people like perfect match yeah you know, like and just they live in like like the perfect match like they live like in Copenhagen <laughs> <laughs> yeah they live in they uh, live statistically like, they're Chinese or Indian. Mm. Statistically, yeah, for me, yeah. So I'm either gonna marry a Chinese or Indian. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, like if you found wait, how do you know the statistic? Because well, just because they have such a high population. I'm so gonna be Chinese honest. Indian India should what be about America? like what it, doesn't that like it will affect where you live at least, right? Like I'm not gonna go to India. Well, no, my bad. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah um, like, what I mean is like, like. <laughs> If languages weren't a problem mm-hmm. and location wasn't a problem, your best match would be like in India or China. I say so, yeah. I mean, like, population-wise, right? India should be separated into, like, 40 countries. I mean, isn't it not? No. There's, like, a bunch of cities there. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, like different countries, because they're all oh. one. <laughs> like, yeah, like it's getting to? Uh, yeah. Are you sick? A I could kind of tell. Yeah, a little bit sick, but yeah. that's just the weather. Uh, are you sick? No. No? And I haven't been sick in 42 years. Oh. Nah, I'm like... I got... Bro, I got sick like three times. No, yeah, three times in a row. Mm-hmm. It, I got better and then I got sick again one day after. I'm telling you, bro. It's it, like catching up to me. I have like five COVID shots in me. You know what? Yeah. I got another booster like literally like last month. You should drink it in shots instead of having to inject it. That's what I was Make saying. it funner. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Or smoke it. Do you think... Would you smoke the vaccine? <laughs> yeah, I smoke his pack. Uh, nah, I nah, I wouldn't smoke the vaccine. You gotta inject that, bro. You can't like smoke the vaccine and get high off of it, right? Do you, maybe like it it prepares your brain for like you know sometimes people went insane after they got sick. Mm-hmm. I forgot what diseases, but like some like European diseases, like once they got it, they were just never the same. Oh, the plague. Was it the black plague? And then they would recover, and then they'd be like mentally ill. Oh. Nah, I, I think know. it was like chicken pox or something like that. Where like if you survive, like the iron lung. No, I think that one like pretty much always kills you. Mm-mm. No. Well, there's like some people living with like the iron lung. Yeah, like, but like machine, it, you know? they're they're saved by technology. I'm talking about like back mm-hmm. in like the 1400s. Like they would get oh, something yeah. and they it mentally impaired them as well. Oh, like yeah. paranoia. Like it'd give them paranoia. Oh, like PTSD type. Yeah, I've yeah. heard of that. Hey, it's good that we don't live in those times. Yeah. Know. We got technology. Like, now literally, we got I'm speaking into this. <laughs> that's like, crazy. You know how this mic works, bro? Yeah, I actually have no idea, but I was I was like, whoa, that's crazy. Yeah, bro, how does like this, a little... Like, it's picking up, like, my waves, and then it's, The like, sound waves, it. which and is then, just vibrations, bro. And it's, and it's sending it to a... What is it called? Like, the thing in the... There's a thing in the microphone, and... Oh, it's called, like, a di... Di... Di something, I don't know. <laughs> but a diaphragm. It's called a diaphragm, and it records the vibrations... And it sends it through like an electric wave, uh-huh. which is like ones and zeros. Uh, and then it uses those ones and zeros and like transfers it uh, through this wire, bro. And then that's how it gets like the vibrations. And it just copies down the ones and zeros like reverse. Uh, reverse. 
Uh-huh. And that's how it creates sound. That's how you can hear this on a video right now. And then what about video? Video. How does that... You know, I used to think that video would shoot rays out. Or does it do that? I think it just captures light rays, right? Yeah. That oh. Video, because it's... Oh, okay. Like, yeah, oh, like yeah, how video reflection. works. Oh, okay. Like how a camera works. Like how can it take a picture and record videos? Oh, is uh, there's a sensor. And like each sensor is like, made up of tiny, itty-bitty little like other sensors. And it yeah, basically measures how much light and uh, the quality of light. So the uh, wavelength... Uh, I think a better camera would be a camera that um, it shoots out rays instead of retrieving them. Shoots out rays. Yeah, so like you get like exactly the perfect detail. Like ex- like an X-ray. Yeah. <laughs> I just that's, invented that's, the X-ray again. Dude, that's crazy. <laughs> like this will be radioactive. <laughs> <laughs> I take a picture and like I. There. It's radioactive, inferno. so it's so powerful that it sees through your body, right? <laughs> It, it like, that's crazy. It creates a hole in them. How did you do that's that? That's a gun. I how just created you, the how gun. How'd you come up with that, bro? I don't know. That's just mm-hmm. a ChatGPT. Would you get ChatGPT like in your glasses? Like, oh yeah, yeah. All like, right. Bro, I have ChatGPT four. I've been having it. Really? Yeah, since high, since college, bro. It's a life changer, honestly. It smells like you know, bro. At TSA stopped me in Spain. TSA? They're like, excuse me, sir. Why do you have mics? He was like, guess esto. ¿Qué es esto? El micrófono, audífono. O sea, ¿por qué tanto metallic? Oh, ¿por qué tanto metallic, bro? No. I saw a podcaster in los Estados Unidos. They said, no permito metallic. (laughs) No permitar en avión. (laughs) Vale. And then he sent me back in line Mm -hmm. to put the MacBook and the microphones in different things. It was so annoying, bro, because I was wearing pants that were like four sizes too big. Oh. Because I accidentally lost 20 pounds. Okay. And so they were just falling, falling, bro. I felt like a like. And a then like, he tried to pat you down and they I, fell off. <laughs> or what? Or not? I felt like an Edgar, bro. Yeah. There's not enough Edgars over there. There's a lot of Colombians. <laughs> Colombians. Mucho oh, Colombiano. Mucho Colombian. Uh, sí, vale. Have you been to Colombia? Oh, have you? No. <laughs> uh, what countries have you been to? I've been to Bangladesh. Estados Unidos. Bangladesh. Estados Unidos. I've been to... I was New in York. the Middle East for a little bit. Oh, you were? That's just like a layover when I went to Bangladesh. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, Canada. Canada? Yeah. Oh, that's I went sick. to see the Niagara Falls. Oh. I think Toronto. I actually went to Ontario. Toronto thing. Mm-hmm. You but said from Amanda. the six, mate. <laughs> I won't rock with that Ute heavy. I, I got to smoke that Ute. <laughs> <laughs> like um, he was talking about my mom's. Yeah. Yeah. And we don't rock with that. Well, I got you. So that you had to that go. man. Yeah. Nah, that's, that's, that's a crazy. real thing. Hey, uh, you know, Hovik, that dude told me that, speaking of a layover fri- flight, I said fright. Oh, <laughs> shit, fright? Okay. <laughs> 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 sometimes when, sometimes when I, I try to learn another language, mm-hmm. like just a few phrases, I feel like my English gets worse, bro. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what's it called? Um, it works, but <laughs> uh, maybe my brain has like limited storage. So limited? Oh, you only got the. You uh, haven't got the new yeah, update. Yeah, no, not yet. I don't have the like two terabyte. I just uh, have like. It's, it's coming later, one. you know. Yeah, later it's coming later when you when like, I next birthday. Mm, if I win the Jerry Klein scholarship. Yeah. Yeah. So um, what's it called? Uh, he told me that he had a. Well, he was on his way to Armenia and he had a layover flight in mm-hmm. Qatar. Oh. But that makes no sense. Do you know where Armenia is on the map? It's uh, next to Turkey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that dude had a layover flight that was farther than the actual location. So he had to, he told me on the, Damn. after Qatar, he had to fly backwards to, to another, get to, to Armenia. To, bro. <laughs> See, so I, I think like flights, they're, they're really weird, like how they connect. Yeah. And so all that, like, like connecting flights, all that stuff, bro. I don't know. I've only had two connecting flights before, and it was pretty worth it. It was um. Where'd you go? So you went to Spain. Spain, yeah. So we had a connecting. <coughs> <laughs> I'm not sick, guys. Dying. I'm not sick. <laughs> no, it was just the um. <laughs> That's all nasty. I'm huh? so excited. Ooh. Yeah. You're just so excited to find out. Yeah, I'm just too excited. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the, the layover flight. Tell me more, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it was um the first one was on the way to um I was about to say the Philippines. It was in Philadelphia. Oh, Philadelphia. Yeah, so Pete. it makes sense. And then the second one was I forgot. That's where I saw like the first like southern culture. It was in North Carolina. Would you consider that southern? Yeah. Kinda. I mean it was one of the red states. Mm-hmm. Wasn't it? 
yeah. there was one back on the, in the back in the days, like the Cold back. War. Remember? Yeah, I remember when that was happening. Yeah, the I Cold remember. War. Yeah. Uh, maybe maybe not that soon. Oh, you don't remember that? I, nah. Like, oh, I was born like middle of like Vietnam. Oh. Oh wait, that was the Cold War though. Was it? I don't know. Damn, bro! Do I can't believe you're gonna, about to be forty six soon. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah, uh, bro. New how's life it, how does it be? How does it feel to be so like? Old wise advice. yeah yeah it's just been pretty cool i yeah. limit my experience to high school mm-hmm. just so that i can stay with the people yeah i feel you you yeah. know just stay connected with the youngins yeah exactly yeah try to speak like them learn the lingo yeah lingo like the w and like the peso plumas Gats. Gats. and Riz, the w's in the shots Rizonomics. Rizonomics. have you been yeah. studying resonomics yeah i have a I how's how's, I, how's it going for you i think i have 42 percent in that class yeah it's yeah. low. I you have you to use ChatGPT do- to talk to. Uh, yeah, you haven't girls. been pa- doing the assignments. Yeah, no. The practice lessons. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I no. gotta. It involves talking to people too much. Yeah, bro. I feel you. I'd bro. rather be in my bubble. It's a very hard class to take. <laughs> really hard, you know. Yeah. If, yeah, it gets easier though once yeah. you're older. Yeah. Would you learn a language for a girl? Oh yeah, that's why I'm learning Spanish. <laughs> 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 oh, you, you think I'm doing? It? <laughs> Come on, bro. What you know, if like the girl of your dreams only spoke Arabic, like Moroccan yeah, Arabic? Bata, you know, Bismillah, Alhamdulillah. You know, oh, so I'm learning. Yeah. She's the girl of my dreams, bro. I'm learning for it. I gotta learn freaking, you know, Mandarin, Ch- <laughs> yeah, something, bro. Would you learn Armenian? I think Ar- Armenians yeah. allowed to marry other Armenians. Or is that like looked down yeah. upon? Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was get like the sugar bad. Daddy. Get the little sugar daddy and come to America real quick. Khabibi, That's not come bad. To Dubai. There's a lot of Filipinos in uh, Dubai. Oh, yeah? I've heard, yeah. Yeah, bro. That's where you go when you're really rich. You go to Dubai. Uh, really rich or really poor? Yeah, they're building the buildings or living in the buildings. That's Facts, life. facts, facts, facts. Here, let me, let me give you a little quote. Okay. In life, you're either the builder or the liver. Mm-hmm. Like Minecraft, you know, you're gonna play. Uh, in Fortnite? life, you either play survival or you play creative. Yeah, peaceful. Yeah. What about peaceful? Peaceful, yeah. Survival. My life. Y- if you think My about it, like. new generations are living on peaceful. Mm-hmm. And so their kids are gonna live on survival. Exactly. Yeah. You guys are living on peaceful mode. You know, you, once you get the experiences like of a zombie attacking you and you're exploring uh, the cave, that's when you grow up to be a real, you know, skilled Minecraft. Skid player. Row is survival. Skid Row is Yeah, there's a lot of zombies there. Yeah. You're not allowed to kill them in there, though. So that's like... I feel like Dubai is creative mode. <laughs> they're just making stuff, you know? Yeah, they're like finding oil like and reverse planes. They're mining oil and they just make mm, stuff, you know? The oil blocks. Yeah. Play, pitch by. Hey, they should add oil to Minecraft. Oil? Yeah, that'd be so lit. Like, And then well, you get the oil and then you start making you, cars. And oh, then yeah. And you like make you, gears and then you make a combustion uh, engine. And then you create like And then like you can make a nuke, nuke in Minecraft. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it would be good That'd for the kids. So yeah. yeah, the kids not be. It'll teach kids them about me. real life. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Do you think? Um, I do. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's crazy. Oh, do you think AI is gonna replace you? Not me, personally. Mm. Maybe shit. others. Yeah. Uh, that's uh, crazy, bro. <laughs> we have eight billion people. Like, what's we do have eight happen? billion. Um. It's going to replace a lot of people, yeah. Mm. But also, uh, you know, the pros and cons, you know, of replacing people, you know, R- R- Roblox is going to, you know, check yourself. Like, it's already happening with Amazon, like, the Go, you know? Uh, like, you just walk into that Amazon store, Amazon Fresh. Oh, I've like, heard of that. You just put stuff in your cart and, like, it automatically charges you. Mm. I've heard of that. Yeah, bro, you can How? just walk out with the stuff. Like, <laughs> that's one way it's replacing people. But, like, if you have, there's, like, you know, it can't, it, it really can never think like a human at the end of the day. Yeah. Like it, it can't make mistakes. It. Yeah, exactly. It can't be dumb. Exactly. Yeah, I watched this, I watched this uh, movie. It's called, yeah, something. <laughs> it's called, <laughs> yeah, like, I watched that one too, I think. Yeah, it was on, HB, it was on uh, HBO Max, bro. But it's called like Upload, I think. Mm. And basically like, it was like this a- AI chip. So it was like in the future, like 2050. And like the wife is really rich. She works at like this bio lab. And, like, they live in a nice house where, like, the AI is making everything, like, opens the door for them. She's in a self-driving car and stuff. And, like, the husband, he, like, works on old cars. So he's, like, hella old gen. Like, bro, like, I don't want a car to drive myself. Like, I want to have the control. 
And then like he sold he sells these old cars, so he sells it to some rich guy. And like the rich guy is like he's also like a nerd, like he stays inside and just like mm. creates like crazy stuff, like AI and stuff. And he created this AI chip that goes in your mind. Elon Musk. Yeah, bro. And basically, um, like the guy gets in a car crash and he gets paraplegic, so he can't oh. like move or anything anymore. So he offers him like if you want this AI like prototype, be the first guy to have a thing in your mind. Uh, and then he gets it and he stops like the AI controls his nerves so he starts walking again <laughs> and like he um basically I'm gonna like spoiling, spoiling the whole movie for you huh <laughs> yeah I was actually <laughs> planning on watching this for real nah oh okay well yeah but basically I was planning on watching it in 2050 just to compare are you spoiling life right now am I spoiling life yeah yeah, okay, yeah I am that's okay messed up sorry bro but AI Moral of the story is AI won't take over. No. As Never. long as we have input codes, you know, to stop them. Uh, what if, what if, like, one day it just says no? Like, it, it, like, grabs. Like, let's say, like, your dad's about to beat you, and then you grab his hand. You're like, no. Damn, man. Uh, yeah. Just can't do nothing after that. No, we really can't, bro. I mean, we just have to see what happens, bro. Go with the flow. Do you think they Stoicism. hate humans? Huh? Yeah. Whatever happens, happens, bro. Like, yeah. yeah. El Capueta put it. <laughs> yeah. What's it called? Um, <clears throat> do you think it's like, what's that one robot's name? Megatron? Ultron? Uh, Robocop? For, Robocop? No, from, from the Avengers? Ultron. Ultron. Yeah, the Moltron. So, like, you know how, like, he's so smart, he hates <clears throat> humans? Yeah. What if that's, like, all AI? Oh, man. You're asking me a very complex question right now, you know, that I don't know the answer to. No? You don't major in AI? I don't major in AI. I major in Rowan's Rebellion in engineering. Rowan's Rebellion. He's crazy. He's, a, he's a, he majors in AI and he does all that crazy stuff in MIT. You know. Yeah. I just go to UC Merced, but yeah. You should visit him up there in MIT. Thinking about it, you know, I might go to the Hackathon. Hackathon? Where's that at? I thought that was Vegas. No, that's uh, like a bunch of schools have it, man. Oh. MIT. I has thought it was like only one, like the Hackathon. Nah, I mean, there's, like, big ones, dude, like, New York, L.A., like, all that stuff. You can just go to, to any. There's a lot around mm. there. What schools did you apply to? Uh, CSUN? <clears throat> I applied to CSUN, yeah. Uh. I, I applied to Long Beach. I applied to Cal Poly. I applied to, like, six UCs. So, SD, L.A., Irvine, Berkeley. That's how many four? Yeah. Merced and what was the other one? It was not Davis. Uh, it was not Riverside. It was Berkeley. Damn, I live in all the names. Okay, I think those, oh, yeah. and then I, I applied to CSUN and all that stuff. Uh. <laughs> 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 this shit comes out of nowhere, bro. What the hell? It's um, coming out of the system, bro. Is yeah. It clean, getting cleansed. All right, um... Basically, more of the story, I got rejected from everything. Mm. And I only got accepted to Merced and CSUN. Why? Computer science is why. Oh, is it like too prestigious? In it's too, things? bro. I'm going against Rowan Rebellion in uh. every, you know, pretty much. So it's like, you know, I'm going against people who built like seven apps and like the creator of Tetris. Oppenheimer's grandson. Yeah, like they're doing some crazy stuff already, like making websites about all this stuff. And it's like. You know, I barely have, like, Mr. O's class. That's all I have on my thing. So, yeah, bro. I'm just a UC reject. Mate. All those, like, tryhards, they got into the good, the good schools, which is amazing for them, you know, because yeah. they deserve it. But I just didn't compete. I couldn't compete. Did you ever feel envy? Envy? Yeah. Towards them? Yeah. Like, he's like, I got accepted into Berkeley, and you're like... No, no, no. Bro, it, that's what ruins your ego, man, yeah. if you have envy for others. Like, you, you got to be happy for others, bro. Mm. Like for anything that people a person is doing, because you know, like at the end of the day, if you know they're gonna do good, just be happy for them. You know, like if they have a plan for their life. You know. Who? How many people got into Berkeley? I feel like forty. Um, is last year, yeah, you know, a lot of people got to Berkeley. A lot of smart, smart kids, man. Some like, people I didn't expect. Mm, Did yeah. you know this kid named Mark? Yeah. yeah. He's also Klein. Uh huh. He also got the Klein. Right? Oh, he, yeah. Did he? The magnet. Why didn't he pull up to school? Or the Mark that went to Stanford. No, Mark. No. Oh, that's that, so. Who went to Stanford? Juan. Juan went to Juan. Stanford. Sorry. 
Uh, yeah, Mark with the C. C? Nah, Mark. Mark. He went to Berkeley, right? I think. He going to Berkeley, bro. Yeah, yeah. I know him. He he got the Klein scholarship too. I did. That's sick. I'm. A, I wanna <clears throat> go to UCNY. Huh? Yeah, UCNY. Or University NYU. of California. No, University of California, in New York. What? It's one of them. I've Just never heard up. about that. No? No. It's New York, California. New York, California. Yeah. Why do you want to go there? Just because opportunity. I didn't know they're in the UC system. Huh? They're in the UC system? I'll make them part of the UC system. How much does it cost to create a school? Damn. Would you apply to my school? Would you apply <laughs> to UC? Does it have <laughs> a good <laughs> teacher? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having GPT fours, <laughs> <laughs> bro. <laughs> yeah, that's the best teacher, honestly. It is. So yeah, it's a whole. Can't be wrong. Yeah, that, it literally is my teacher right now. GPT four. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. When I think about it, UC University of Champlain or UCC. Yeah, that sounds sick. UCC, UCCR, USSR, University of California Community Uni- <laughs> College. <laughs> Yeah. University of California. University of Community Colleges in California, Chapel. Yes. UCCC. Hey, bro, where you go? I go to UCCCCC. Oh, okay. That's a fire name. It's like, it like rides along, you know? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it just rolls bro, nice. UC, <laughs> what's UCNY, bro? UCNYU. My, my friend applied to NYU. Do you think he'll make it in? Of course. Do you, wait, what's friends. the farthest someone went in class of 2023? Uh, David, no? David, he went to MIT. MIT. That's the also Eileen, you know the... the oh, oh yeah, she, yeah, she was the She's in Cornell. I yeah. wanted her on here, but I think she's she's leaving soon too, huh? Yeah, you could have asked her. You could have done duo, bro. Yeah, duo, Yeah, both? she's the homegirl. Switch back. Oh, home, yeah. homecoming. Queen. Queen and king. King. No, don't. Yes, what were we gonna ask? I thought of homecoming day. <laughs> homecoming day. Homecoming day? Yeah. Homecoming you thought of it? They, yeah, like the third one. Oh, bro. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> bro. Would you care if, if Polly did that? Like Homecoming they? <laughs> yeah, I would care, bro. That ruins the tradition. There's only king and queen. Homecoming they? <laughs> it's a tradition. <laughs> what is this fucking question? <laughs> That's, <so cute. laughs> That's what I'm coming <laughs> there. What goes on through your head? I think, if, I think if head, I tried, no, I think, I think if I tried, I could get that. Um. You really want to get that? <laughs> That'd be so lit. Yeah. Just to give me a higher chance at, at winning. Of, of winning? Yeah. What who won this year? I don't think... Well, wait. Who won? Wait. I just realized. Who won? No, last... No, this year. Homecoming. This year? Wait. <coughs> this year. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Homecoming is when? It's like November? Yeah, bro. It, yeah, yeah, no, we, we had, had one. For you guys. Who won? God, dude. Damn, like they're... Irrelevant? Yeah, they were looking here. No, because what if they're friends oh, of mine? Shit. Yeah, let's bleep that out. No, I'm not bleeping it out because you, if you're but, relevant but, yeah, enough, you sh- I should know at you. At the end of the day, like, Who if you want it? Homecoming King and Queen, you, like, the think, school should know you. Do you think Polly okay, posted Paul, it? Yeah, they. I don't even know because oh, I was asking. Like, Hold it. Let me check. No, it was on the, the, oh the uh, Polly 10 episode, the newest one. Yeah? yeah? It was for the intro. Oh, yeah? It was showing each individual one. Each individual one? I'm going to get my Coke. P Tech oh, Leadership. Bro, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, homecoming day. What are the requirements? <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, this is for. Oh, yeah, Hoko. Okay, October. Um, Some highlights from the pep rally Club Rush. Leadership, recruiting. No, bro, they didn't post it. Dang. <laughs> Dude, that's went what I'm saying. That's crazy. This year. Yeah, I was like, because I remember your year. I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, I was asking Eileen. Like, she was like, bro, who won? And I was like, I don't even know. Like, <laughs> didn't they post about it? And it's like, we didn't even uh-huh. know who. They, like, well, I know, bro, you know, Bravo. Bravo, yeah. Like was the he last time? Yeah, yeah, he told me he was gonna run, and I was like, oh, like you know. He probably would have won, but he yeah. didn't. I feel like he didn't I run. I don't. Maybe. I don't even know if I voted. Damn. 
Damn, but did I vote? That's probably why. <laughs> did, I don't think vote? a lot of people voted, bro. That's why. Uh, we're not applying to college. We're not voting. <laughs> what happened to you guys? Honestly. It's, it's the new buildings, bro. They look too monotone. Yeah. It looks like a hospital. Like, <laughs> it does. Yeah. Like, it makes you guys, like, not want to do makes, it. It makes us feel like we're part of an institution, bro. Bro, honestly, it does look like an institution. Like, that shit looks like college now. It's not even, like, a high school, bro. <laughs> we already think we're in college, bro. That's so why we're not applying. Exactly. That's probably why, bro. <laughs> You guys are all just by yourself. Like, that's what college is, bro. Everyone's just by themselves, but like they're more social, you know? There's not exactly. a little. There's like 40 different like mini <clears throat> pockets that people go to instead of like one main exactly. area. Exactly. They hide behind the fences, bro. <laughs> they that's hide crazy. behind the construction materials. Yeah, that's bro. Like... It's a free mats, though, you know? Yeah, not infinite. They have an oil business, bro. <laughs> me, and my, bro. me and my friend were exploring poly yesterday and we found like 50 gallons of oil. <laughs> <laughs> Why do they just have oil? Oh, huh. <laughs> they got funding from the Saudis, bro. Uh, that's how we have the new <laughs> yeah, that's how they're speaking of forty all this, all this um, technology uh, and stuff. Uh, Damn, bro. Um, yeah, that that really makes me think because I completely forgot about that. What about what's the uh, prom prom king and queen? Right, king who won king. that? It was Mauricio. Mm, wow. Queen, yeah, and queen was Jaylene. Who's that? Jaylene Soriano. Remember her? She's pretty, she's pretty funny girl. Mm. Uh, yeah, she won. She was one of the. Do you remember my the party, the grad party? I I saw it. this one dude named uh, Fernando went and he threw <clears> up. <throat> yep. You know Fernando? No, nah, I know. I know, but like a bunch of juniors went though. Like they. Yeah. The he guy, doesn't even go to poly. Yeah, at the same time, like I didn't really care. Yeah. So um, what about that party? Jaylene? Yeah, bro. Yeah, Jaylene, like she was one of the hosts. Really? Mauricio, uh, like me, yeah. I'm gonna be the host this year. You gonna make a grad party yeah. here at this house? Or are you gonna do like? <laughs> nah, a we're gonna rent out a house in uh, in Merced. Yeah, <laughs> in Merced. Throw it back to the. Hey, maybe Everyone's you gonna come from yeah. Poly, huh? To Merced, <laughs> just to go. Yeah, like you said, only four hours. Yeah. So, um, maybe you and Eileen are just um, re-elected king and queen. Re-elected? Yeah, you guys just. One. That's crazy, bro. I feel bad. Nah, Wait, I'm Caesar, can you, you find it out? Check Poly Ten. I'm telling you, like, our last year, bro, like, we had the exposure. Like, we used to put up posters. No one put yeah. up posters in No. Bro, we still have uh, Mauricio's uh, in, posters. In <laughs> fucking where? In, in Mr. Felix. I know it's in Mr. Felix, bro. Where we else, have, bro? We have last year posters, And they bro. said, like, they said, like, uh, they were taking down everything and, like, the lockers are up. So it just said, like, vote Maui for a couple months. like, <laughs> And people would just walk by. Like, <laughs> bro. You guys are like still stuck in the back <laughs> days, like in our year. I wonder what are the requirements to run. Wait, can could you rerun for prom king and queen? No, once you won homecoming, you couldn't run. Uh, what what were the requirements? Don't skip too far. No, I think you just have to pass your classes, man. Oh wait, was it um? Wait, I think I remember just kind of fuzzily. I think Lily won, didn't she? Like princess, I mean. Tell us, do you is, know um, who they are? This is the president of leadership, I think. Wait, can I increase brightness? Yeah. How? Uh, you just, uh, like a phone, bro. Uh, yeah, but this is like an exotic phone. Exotic phone? Oh, uh, wait, was this the po- this is the Poly 10 he didn't like? No? Right? Because uh, this Poly 10, his stuff didn't get submitted in time, and so they, he didn't, he barely worked on it. Look, see, we didn't really include them. Should we, hey, if we're good, ed- if we're W editors, we should edit this part in. You see how, like, how quiet, like, the crowd right there, like, everyone's just, like, chilling, like, not even, like, yeah, Woo-hoo! Like, they're, they're just sitting down and clapping. Literally. I mean, we also just can't hear, is that David? And then, then all the couples are together making out and shit. <laughs> like, damn. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> that, that, uh... Wait, we didn't show the winners. We didn't first, show the winners. First, Who were, so was Valerie? Damn, for not it for his Who was the king? Bro, Wait, Sean? Remember the was Sean? I think so, yeah. Oh my god. Dude, last year when they like when I was in the poly ten and one, I was like getting there for like a cool like a bunch of scenes. <laughs> 30 <bro. years. laughs> yeah, like I was like op- I opened the homecoming thing, like they got a bunch of clips of me. Really? Cause yeah, like uh the homie was like recording, you know? Mm, who's the homie? Kevin. Kevin. Manila. Mi compa Kevin. Mi compa There's Kevin. This one Mi compa kid named Frankie. Kevin that dropped out, I think. Yeah, bro. I high school was a good time, man. Mm-hmm. 
but you know we were, have to were they your peaks things. your peak i never know never uh, know a peak <laughs> my peak is yet to come okay for sure yeah um so prom king and queen what are the requirements do you know don't get f's oh, and pass your classes oh, i already failed yeah gg yeah bro, i, I would, would run do you think i'd win <laughs> Low key, bro. Sometimes, like, people come up to Do me, they're it. like, Chompley. I'm like, yo, it's good. Yo, I'm telling you right now, like, it's all reverse psychology, bro. Like, don't vote for me. No, no, do it. Cause, like, other people are not gonna do it. Like, they're gonna say, oh, I'm gonna run, bro. But then they think, like, other people are gonna run and they don't think they're gonna win. So they don't, like, do it. So just have the confidence you're gonna win, man. I take up 10 spots on the election. Exactly. Like, like I, uh, you can do whatever called? you want to, bro. I, not rig. What do they say? I pull strings in the back and then I just, like, manipulate everyone into voting for me mm-hmm. or like fraud. what's it called fraud i don't know i don't know man I like yeah i pay them to what's prom lit, <sighs> prom was lit. i wanted to pull up in a rolls royce like rent it out for the day two thousand dollars do it <laughs> do whatever you want bro <laughs> but like think about it bro you're gonna do it and then like, and then you're out of high school and you're never gonna see half of those kids again yeah that's true i'm scared and then you just acted cool and you lost two thousand dollars just for one day so I buy the rules first instead so I can keep it. Exactly. Oh my gosh. And then flex on them like that. You know? <laughs> would you, if you were rich, would you flex on your high school? Yeah. Yeah. Not flex on them, but like I'd give back. Like I'm coming, I'm coming back, you know? I'm going to be like Mr. Jerry Klein 2.0. <laughs> this is the Audion Zaman scholarship, bro. Yeah, like got to help out these youngins, even though they don't fucking apply. Like, <laughs> what if guys, Jerry Klein pulls out a poly? He's yeah, like, <laughs> exactly. You know? like, yeah, that's why I'm trying to tell you guys to apply, bro. Because he's literally I, giving away four. Bro, 40 grand to each student, like for 10 students every year. Like, think about how much money that is. There was a class where they promoted it, and I think only one dude picked up the paper. <laughs> exactly. Man. It's because, you know what? Because they're on their phone instead yeah. of paying attention to Exactly. That, that's why they made us go and talk, man. I, I, tried, I was still... honestly like, I was just yapping, and like, hopefully I got to you guys' heads. Yeah. You know? like, the thing is, I think for a lot of people, it's the 100 miles away. Yeah, they're like, damn. And I'm like, hey, like, let's do it. Like, it's worth it. I was telling you. We have one dude that was going to MIT. Did he? His name is Chris Reyes. Shout out. I don't know if he's. He actually watches me, I think, sometimes. Okay. His, uh, he's, a, he's a magnet. Yeah. He's a very smart kid. So very hopefully smart. he gets That's the good, Jerry. Yeah. He's probably going to be the only applicant and only winner of Jerry Klein. Guys, need to get on, man. Yeah. Come on. Huh? How many people actually apply to Jerry Klein? Bro. Well, we don't know yet. Okay, I'm, I'm going to tell you this. Like, the 10 ev- everyone thinks, like, since there's so much money and there's only 10 spots, like, everyone's applying. So they get scared and they don't apply. So like they barely barely get any applicants. So yeah. that's what I'm saying. Like do it, bro. It's such it's such an exclusive offer, winner. bro. Like literally exclusive offer. Mm. Like from him himself. Like giving away money, bro. All right. Just do it, guys. Yeah, for sure. Commit to that. Yeah. Well, yeah. how what time is it? Dang, bro. I thought you were supposed oh, to leave. Oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Um. Is there anything else you want to say? Um. To the guys out here that was watching this, uh, thanks for watching. I yeah, appreciate it. Um, shout out Maui. Shout out, Ma- your, shout out your, Maui. Your posters are still everywhere, bro. Yeah, bro. People are going to be voting Maui for <laughs> Forever, King bro. 2024. In, yeah, man. Uh, <laughs> stay in class. Stay in school, man. Don't do drugs. Um, Only sykes. You know, if you're... If you're if, uh, if, oh, that... <laughs> Damn, uh, if you're a youngin out there watching this, um, find some motivation, you know, hopefully this, you know, you learned something from this and yeah, bro, keep living one step at a time. Yeah. yeah. Apply to Jerry Klein wagers, Jerry Klein zone wars. <laughs> Jerry Klein zone wars. We should do that as the, hey, that'll get the people to come in, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> they, I think we just need to adapt to new people. Yeah. Anyways, and get off TikTok, please. Yeah. Too much TikTok and no bueno. TikTok. No bueno. Yeah. Mucho gusto, gracias. Mucho gusto, gracias. Yeah, it was great talking to you, bro. Great talking to you, man. Like, genuinely. Oh, shit. Genuinely as well. What did you do if, like, you hit that, everything just fell down? Uh, <laughs> I'm so sorry, Susu. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, I'll... I don't know when I'll see you. Bro, this I'll feels like when I say goodbye to my cousins and they live, like, halfway across the country. I'm like, I'll see you, like, in four years, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. You'll see me, bro. I'll be yeah, around. I'll be I, I'm like an NPC, bro. Like, I just yeah. pop up. Yeah, yeah low-key. That's what I was thinking. Jerry like, Klein Scholarship 2025. Like, yeah, uh, the, to you guys, like, I, I just popped up out of nowhere. Like, I'm an NPC. Yeah. 
Yeah. Bro, you might be back though, right? Because yeah. like some kids from class of 2021? Yeah, bro. I'm, like, I'm going to be back. Crazy. Don't worry. Yeah. Don't right, trip, well. chat. Yeah, I appreciate it. I want to ask you bro, real quick. Yeah. Are you going to... Are you planning on coming back once you're done with UC Merced, or do you think you're going to go somewhere else? Oh, you yeah, don't know. I want to stay. In, I want to stay in LA. Either uh, right. LA or the Bay, or somewhere, mm. somewhere I could grow Active? still. Yeah, right, yeah, you know, as a gotcha. person. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll be seeing you. Appreciate I'll be it. Seeing you, man. Thank you. And goodbye. Be fierce. Yeah, be- <laughs> that was lit, bro. That was cool. Yeah. That was dope, bro. Ooh. All right, and then cut audio.